Red white makes the rules. Red white rolls the dice. Red white's got the personality that makes everyone look twice. Red white draws the lines. Red white deals the cards. People stop me everywhere to be trust me their regards. Hello. But red's a decent man with old fashioned ideals. Red will answer just one question, cause that's just how nice he feels. Well, okay, Mr. White, fine. If Blue Corp isn't for blackmail, what does it do exactly? Ah, uh, Blue Corp, my labor of love, my pride and prejudice. Blue Corp deals in information we buy and sell it to. You may not know that Blue Corp was named for the color blue. Caught it up myself. Mm. Red White gets the best. Red White follows through. Ask not what you can do for Red, but what Red can do for you. And what can Red White do for you, Monsignor? I'll count that last question as a practice. And now, here's your only chance. Make it worthwhile. Okay, Mr. White. Fine. There's one last thing I wanted to know. Who'd you take that statue from? Take? How dare you accusify me of something like that? This is a Paris original straight from Canada. Speaking of, I bet you've never been to Canada. It's not far, in fact, just north from here. Go straight, you can't miss it. I especially love that mountain with the president. Oh, and that big tower that leans to the side. And you can oh, just take it from Senator no Patrick can make you seem Carter, such a... perhaps. <laughs> I'm not familiar with the title of his personage. He's a politician who killed himself. I think I know his name. He was caught embezzling government funds. <laughs> that really is a shame. And then one day, the press got wind of it. Are you quite finished now? And the day after, he killed himself. <laughs> this concerns me how. Me, they knew all about your operation. Your black man has caused countless to die. Blue Corp's blackmailing thrives while you take hundreds of lives, but it stops right here. No more will you paralyze with fear. You have some pretty magnificentatious claims there, Mr. Wrong, was it? <laughs> but how does all this connect with me? Come now, make me laugh. Indulge me. <laughs> it's quite all right to exasperate my prodigal and cosmopolitan sense of humor. Mia Fey found the connection. On this file is a list of suicides, all of them marked with the name White. <laughs> Mr. Wrong. <laughs> Why are you spending all this time investigating me? Shouldn't you be looking for the murderer of your dear Miss Fay? And just what do you think I'm doing, Mr. White? You must have talked to Grody Bird. I guess he had to speak. Grossberg. Ask him why I have his painting. I'll tell you why he's weak. Only the strong survive, kid. And Red White's the alpha male. Red White's the king of the jungle. And that gross face, he's a whale. So don't you come here trying to kick me off my throne. Like he who is with sin and loves it. Cast the final stone. <laughs> Connect me to the chief prosecutor's office, please, and, and call security. I've a raving madman on my hands. Yes, Mr. White. White, what do you want? This isn't a great time. I've decided I want you to testify in tomorrow's trial. It seems the culprit was right here all along. I thought you said you didn't want anything to do with Quietude! I said I changed my mind now, didn't I? And Donna, I believe you're in any position to question me. You didn't! Yeah, Mr. Lawyer. What are you going to do? You don't understand, kid. I control the police. I control the prosecution. I control the judge. I am the law. He who has the money has to control, Mr. Wrong. You're nothing but a mere lawyer. <laughs> it's all me a fay was to. Red White breaks the rules. Red White loads the dice. Red White has the power. So take Red White's advice. Red White stacks the deck. Red White is always ahead. Ask not what Red can do for you, but what you can do for Red.
<laughs> Hi! How are we doing, Pam Police? I'm really excited to get back to this game because it's like my favorite ever. <laughs> I hope you liked my continuing tradition of feeling the need to record a song from the musical. <laughs> like turn about musical. I, I just I always always want an excuse to sing turn about musical. Yeah, the mu the musical includes made up words for Red White because honestly he's just a piece of shit and he likes to make up words. <laughs> it's it's pretty great honestly. Um Red White is probably one of my favorite characters in the whole series just because he's so funny. <laughs> you know one of my dream duo cosplays is to get like I don't know care who any one of my friends is cosplay red white and April May with me because <laughs> they're such an iconic duo they're such an iconic duo they just make me laugh so hard <laughs> so now we're back to destroying them anyway we're back to destroying them have you recovered from cat boys overload no that's okay. I don't think there is any recovering from Catboy's Overload. I think it's just like, I'm, I'm dead now. And I, I, I don't even, I don't even know. There's a very cursed stream that people keep bringing up from my dirty past. Busted Fellows Puns Part 2, ba -ba -ba. yeah? Wow, thank you, Joey. This, this particular pan play Catboy just is encouraging me to do more Otome game hell. <laughs> I gotta say, I almost picked up Buster Fellows today. It's probably gonna happen. It's just a matter of how long I can hold off. <laughs> but um, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm excited for Ace Attorney though too. Ace, you know what would be the best game? Ace Attorney or Tommy game. But who would I date in it? I mean, Pain. It's kind of obvious. Pain's my husband, so I obviously date Pain. <laughs> or all of them. All of the. Oh, it's gotta be one of the modern ones that includes female options. Because I think Mia would be pretty good. Mia, Mia would be a pretty solid option. <laughs> Francesca, Francesca, forgot she existed. Age her up a few years and then we're good. <laughs> but yeah, um, um, I know that there's, there's a deep, dark, secret stream that people keep promoting from my past that haunts me to this day. And it's very embarrassing. And I don't even know if that's my most embarrassing stream anymore. You know, the Catboy stream may have surpassed it. <laughs> I might just be more afraid of people watching the Catboy stream. I might, I might just be more mortified. I didn't think it was possible to be more embarrassed than I was by the other stream, but um, here we are. Here we are. <laughs> here we are, even more embarrassed. Jesus. <laughs> and yeah, only eight days. Oh, my controller died. Only eight days until the great ace tourney, which is why I wanted to bring this one back out. I wanted to finish the current case to ride the hype because I am so damn excited. <laughs> Speaking of which, um, mm, 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 one second, I'm trying to get my controller back. It's on, it's just not connecting again for some reason. I'll get it, it's fine. Um, speak, ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Ay, 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 ay. Um, dun, dun, dun. I don't remember what I was really saying. <laughs> I don't, Remember. Yeah, it does come out next week. It does, it does, it does. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, I was saying um, the promotions and demotions. So, Red White specializes in bullshit. And to take him down, it's gonna be really hard. We're gonna need a lot of witnesses. So, everyone here on time today, you are promoted to being extra witnesses for that case. So, what that means, I need you to, like, somehow become a victim of red white <laughs> and then testify so, and prove that he hurt you so that i can get him arrested so basically yeah i just i need you to i need you to be victimized by this guy somehow and then i will use you in court as evidence <laughs> and everyone is not here on time it really sucks to be them they're just gonna be court gallery that's boring they don't get to be involved they don't get to be involved. That's that's just so disappointing. <laughs> so yeah. Pan, your free shipping idea made me spend lots of money on PlayAsia worth every penny. Nice. 
It, yeah. I spend a lot of my own money to just back. Because, I mean, it goes back to me. So, it's not really like I'm spending money anyway. <laughs> and, I mean, it doesn't have to ship very far. It's just like the opposite end of the warehouse. But, still, it got me too. I know the feeling. <laughs> I know the feeling. But anyway, I'm excited to play more of this game. I'm excited to play more of this game. I I like this case a lot, but the next case is my favorite. So I wanted to finish this one before the Great Ace Attorney comes out. And I won't start the next one. But we might watch the cutscene just because I love it. <laughs> it's the best. It, it, Cody Hackins is my favorite character in the whole Ace Attorney franchise. He's such a little brat. I love him. He is my son. <laughs> he is my son. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna jump into the game now. A little faster than usual just because I'm so excited. <laughs> Give me a sec. The volume is still okay too. I know it's been jumping around a little bit lately, so I can change it if I need to. Or was I? Oh wait. Hi. Oh yeah, there we go. Um, can it out sisters? Oh. Hmm. I think yeah, the bottom one, the bottom one. We're like at the end of the investigation though, because we got electrocuted, didn't we? <laughs> I think we got electrocuted. I know I say that about every character, but every other character, it's like, it's like they're almost my favorite. Cody Hackins is actually my favorite. I I, I love him so much. <laughs> He's hilarious. Okay. Okay. We're gonna load it. Oh, we didn't get electrocuted yet. I guess we have to do that again then. Anyway, let me show you around this guy's office so you can see what a little shit he is. So he's got tables of um, his naked butt and body, I suppose. His head's the table. <laughs> and it's made of gold. Although I kind of suspect that it's probably made of something cheaper and shitty and just plated in gold. Because then he can pretend it's pure gold but he can spend less money because a good CEO knows you gotta like, you gotta hoard that money. <laughs> Another one of himself holding up the world, but the world is just his company because that's the world. I mean, Play Asia is also my world, so I, I get it. <laughs> he is, um, no, this isn't my desk. Mine, they have cat boy tails. Um, that's how you can tell the difference. I was inspired by his desk, though. I was really inspired by his desk. But this isn't my desk. It's missing the tails. That's how you know the difference. Okay. Boss, this is the Japanese physical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the Japanese physical version. Because I'm a collector and I really wanted the physical version. <laughs> okay. Um. I thought I did everything here. Um. I thought I already got electrocuted. Maybe I spoiled that, I guess. <laughs> I'm still my badge. I'm hitting A. Don't do this to me again. I'm hitting. Okay, one second. I got, I got my pro controller here too. I like to use my other controllers too for some things, but right now it's not behaving, so pro controller it is. <laughs> oh, you press X. I'm an idiot. I was pressing the wrong button. <laughs> Would you be kind enough to cease your inane chattering and vacate the premises? No. Let me put it in a language you are sure to understand. Shut up and get out. Okay, I'll get out and get an apple in a second. I have nothing more to say. Oh yeah, he electrocuted me and stole my evidence and then I'm still here. <laughs> I, lo I love Red White. I love him so much. Look at his face. Sense. He looks like he jumped straight out of JoJo. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's anything else I can show him, but... Hmm. Show him in himself. 
I'll show him in his cell. Ah, I guess I can't do anything right now. No matter what I show him, he's just gonna kick me out, isn't he? <laughs> okay, bye. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, come on. One second. use the pro controller anyway. <laughs> I got the other one working, but it's still kind of half working. Uh, maybe I have to go back to the detention center, I think. Apparently, Miss May is in questioning. I doubt they'll let me talk to her today. I'm new to your channel, enjoying your stream. Hi, hi, hi. I'm glad you got to be new at this one and not the last stream. <laughs> I still feel so bad for everyone that was new in the last stream. Okay, well, that's useless. I can't talk to her. Where do I need to... Oh, I, maybe I have to go back to Grossberg. Yeah! Burr. 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 Ah, I don't think he's noticed me standing here. <laughs> he doesn't even know that I'm here. Maybe I should clear my throat. <laughs> You don't pick your house so fast. Oh, you. What's wrong? You look so pensive. Like an old man at the end of his days. <laughs> uh, I'm not senile yet. I was just thinking about the whole mess. Something's really bothering him. That much is clear. <laughs> I love his theme song. I don't think I have anything new to show him. Let's show him Red White's face and show you to appreciate it. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I borrowed this from you. Oh, yeah, I stole the photo from him. I forgot. Oh, so it was you, my boy. Who is this man? Can you introduce me? <laughs> oh, it's a long story. I'll be needing a back now. Oh, he needs his photo back. He wants to hoard it. He just doesn't want to talk about it. Because I've exposed his affair with Red White. I'm gonna give him back his photo so he can put it back in his wallet. So you came to see the trial today? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Something was bothering me all last night. You see, you couldn't get a wake of sleep. Really? What was that? <laughs> one second, one second. I, thought I, I fixed my mouth really nice today, but now it's like a little too open, so I'm gonna fix it. Yeah, I think that's a little better. I was like, I wasn't closing. <laughs> there we go. Really? What was the out? Well, you see, it's just me and my sister. That poor girl. My boy, I owe you my thanks. Truly. Yeah, I'm prosecutor. I'm also a lawyer and I'm also a judge. I'm, I am the law, just like Red White. <laughs> I learned from the best. I don't know what I would have done if things had gone poorly for the girl. I asked before, but why did you refuse her request for defense? Yeah, I mean, it would have really helped a lot. Actually, no. This guy would have just caved into Red White and been like, Yep, she did it, bye! He would have been the worst lawyer for Maya. <laughs> I think I have a right to know. Alright, Mr. Right! No, no, I'm sorry, I just... I need more time to think about it, my boy! He does seem troubled. <laughs> I'm 
starting to have a feeling I know what it is. Yeah, he's just a little nervous about Mr. White. Who isn't, but that's Smolder. Uh, so I paid Blue Corp a visit. Oh! Oh, uh, I see! I don't even remember what voice I gave Grossberg. This is his voice now. <laughs> Mr. Grossberg, I have to admit, something has been bothering me. I... This is gonna sound so stupid, but I'm having so much fun right now. I, I got, like, um a big cushion to put on my chair so I don't have to always sit on my feet. Because if I sat on the chair itself, um, I wasn't high enough and my my tracking didn't work. <laughs> so now I'm I'm sitting on a big pillow, but my feet don't reach the ground anymore. <laughs> so I'm just like kicking my feet constantly. It's it's really amusing. If you hear a weird noise, I probably kicked something by mistake. <laughs> it's just fun to swing my feet around. What is it? Well, now with it, my boy. Yeah, Juice just says that I'm not the best doctor because I killed him by accident, but I healed, I fixed everyone else. I fixed everyone else. Objection, I'm a great doctor. Over 50% success rate. Over 50% success rate. You see, it's just the photo. Why wouldn't you defend Maya? <laughs> I thought it was strange. Here was Maya, your own apprentice's little sister in desperate need. Accused of killing her own sister, no less, and you wouldn't take the case. I finally realized why. You and Red White are connected. He's your boss. No, I'm his boss. He's your lover. <laughs> I was saying that. <laughs> claim to understand. But you and Mr. White are lovers, aren't you? Oh, what, my boy? <laughs> Mr. Grossberg, it's okay. I support you. The other day, there was a giant painting hanging on that wall. <laughs> I saw that painting again today. It was in the CEO's office in Blue Court. <laughs> It was a present, wasn't it? Well, my boy, you have a splendid imagination. <laughs> what are you talking about, imagination? What are you talking about? I, I don't understand how you can. <laughs> well, that's because I'm not. We're not. Don't be ridiculous. Uh, I guess I was wrong. But it just seems so right. <laughs> I know what it actually is. Don't worry. I just thought that was more fun of an answer. Okay, I do need to go back to this topic, though. <laughs> if I also look like I'm spinning in circles, it's because I am. I'm literally spinning in circles while kicking my feet. It's, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't stop. I can't stop. <laughs> it's turning. It's too exciting. <laughs> It's blackmail. I just sang a whole song about the blackmail. <laughs> exactly, Joshua's right. He's just pretending they're not lovers. He's embarrassed about it. <laughs> Mr. White has something on you, doesn't he? Blackmail? I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Mr. Grossberg, sir. Sir. There was a giant painting hanging right there the other day. Was there not? Like where those friggin' hooks are? <laughs> and the one you said you had no intention of parting with. That's very, very suspicious, my dude. Well, I saw it. Today, it was in the CEO's office at PlayAsia. It's mine now. At Blue Corp, Red White's office. It's the ultimate merch. Grossberg's, Grossberg's painting. I would buy the shit out of it. How have I been demoted? You get to just watch and do nothing. Everyone promoted, I need them to like be victimized by red, white in some way and then share their sob story so I can help convict this man faster. And everyone who's demoted is left out bored and lonely. <laughs> so you'd notice. 
I suppose I should have guessed you would. It is a large painting. Mr. Grossberg, tell me what happened. I'll understand. A red white is a man who makes his living through intimidation. I figured that out. <laughs> Blue Corp is a company that excels in finding people's weaknesses, I'm afraid. I've been paying them for 15 years now. Just lots of money for that black mail. 15 years. Wow, that's a long time to be secret lovers. I think you should just admit it already. <laughs> oh, because of the DL6 incident, as you may have guessed. The name on the back of those photographs. Oh, don't worry, we'll get to DL6. You know what would be really cool? If we did the DL6 stream on Christmas. No, 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 just the 26th. The 26th. It would have to be the day after Christmas, wouldn't it? But you know it would also be a fun a fun thing? I'm sorry, I don't know. It depends on the country. I know it, it is in some countries, not in others. On Boxing Day, it would be fun to stream arms. <laughs> but also, I kind of want to, right after Christmas, stream DL6. Because Larry Butts' song about how it's not Christmas. Because it, it was, like, Christmas was over. <laughs> Also, um, oh, you know, almost Christmas. Christmas Eve, Christmas Eve, we gotta stream DL6. <laughs> Christmas Eve, we're gonna eat some fried chicken and stream DL6. <laughs> and it'll be a great time. After Christmas, I really wanna find a way to stream Hotel Dusk, if I can get my DS capture. You do the whole case in a single day? I think it would take me longer than 12 hours, honestly, so probably not. <laughs> I am so tempted. I could not stand in defense of Maya because of this. White would have destroyed me if I did. So that's the connection. Oh, that's, that's me. So that's the connection. It is hard for me to tell you this, my boy. But arresting Great White will be nigh on impossible. Impossible? Why? <laughs> he has information on everyone. Gives him an iron grip. Jones, judges, attorneys, prosecutors, police, and politicians. What? They're brown. Unable to do harm to themselves and therefore to him. Don't look at me like that. What do you see is nothing more than the weight of many years. I'm not judging your weight. I'm judging the weight of your consciousness. You won't even look after. You won't even look after the sister of Mia. As you're an asshole, you're too worried about yourself. <laughs> Sacrifice your pride for her whole fucking life. And let's talk about DL6. What is the DL6 incident? I totally know, but the viewers might not. DL6 is nothing more than the sorting code the police gave the case. That was 15 years ago now. I received a request from a medium. A spirit medium. A medium? Oh, I wonder who that is. Ooh. I want some apple. Uh, uh, uh. Remember why Faye sounds a little, a little suspicious, a little suspicious. It might have something to do with Mia Faye and Maya Faye's last name. Ooh. Indeed, she was Mia's mother. Yes. Which means she's also Maya's mother. She had been investigating a murder at the bequest of the police. And she failed. <laughs> As a result, the police called her a fraud. This is what Maya was talking about the other day. I just 
realized this game is more than 15 years old, yeah. Isn't this game originally from 1999? The one that was on um, Game Boy? Or was it 2001? I think it's either 1999 or 2001. Either way, it's past its 20th anniversary. <laughs> I remember because I bought some 20th anniversary merch. <laughs> I did all my code for her, and in the end, cleared her of wrongdoing. That murder case, however, remains unsolved to this day. It's on Game Boy Advance, I should have specified. <laughs> See, it took me a Game Boy Advance to a Game Boy. It's just different Game Boy. <laughs> that murder case, however, remains unsolved to this day. That case is the DL6 incident. Black but why are you blackmailed over this, Mr. Grossberg? The DL6 incident was top secret at the time. Yeah, Ace Attorney called me into existence. This game gave birth to me. That's why I love it so much. And that's why I'm so obsessed with it. It's my mama. It's my mama. It made sense. The police didn't want people to know they were using a medium. They might not have taken it seriously. Is it your favorite series? Hell yeah. <laughs> they couldn't let people know. But one person found out. I I told him. Oh. So Mia's mom died because of Grossberg. I forgot about that. You told White? He offered me riches. It is an embarrassment to me now. Because I thought the police were mocked far and wide. In, se oh, I got in secret, they began looking for the one who sold them out. Of course, White heard about it and he came to me. Only this time, the offer was blackmail. Yeah, serves you right, you doofus. You dingbat. I see. <laughs> Look at his mustache. It's just jumping on his face. It's just like moving up and down. It's not like it's not like moving in a normal way mustaches do. It's like like someone's dragging it on the screen. <laughs> yeah, the DS re-release had an extra case not included on the GBA. The DS re-release is how I played it. White controls the law of this country as he sees fit. It's a county now. Again, if you will still challenge him. Have a close look at Mia's office. Okay. Mia's office? She followed his every move for years. Hi, Emily. Hello, I'm late. Please scold me. You're demoted. You get to do nothing today. <laughs> Everyone who was promoted, I need them to like be victimized by Red White. And be sob stories that I can use in court. Because um, I need them to be blackmailed by him in some sort of way. But you don't get to. You just get to watch. <laughs> you ever watch the movie? Yeah, I did see the Ace Attorney movie. I love it. I love it. <laughs> it's ridiculous. right? I love it so much. It's one of my favorite live action adaptations. <laughs> Probably tied for my top favorite with the series of unfortunate events in the series. She may have recorded something of what she found. Does that mean I gotta go to the back, back to the office? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's funny, looking at this room, it seems so normal. Hard to imagine a murder took place here. <laughs> Yeah, there's a movie, a live action one. It's really, really good. Mr. Grossberg said there'd be clues. Maybe I should have another look. Hmm. I agree with Noe. I like the graphics on the DS one better. I, I know it's kind of controversial because in everywhere the HD version is considered like the pinnacle of Ace Attorney. But I really like the pixel sprites. I really like the look of it on DS. It had a very nice feel to it. And this doesn't really have the same feel. <laughs> it 
It's like slightly sad because of it. Slightly sad. Oh, the Ace Attorney Layton crossover is really, really good. It's really, really good. <laughs> a salmon. It's a Charlie. Can you have favorite potted plant? I guess I'll have to water it now. <laughs> oh shit, don't give me responsibilities. I'll mess them up. The sky is blue. And so am I. And so am I. Blue because my wife is dead. There's that hotel right across the way. <laughs> Mia's desk. Perfectly clean. As always. <laughs> and the only thing that's missing is... DS days, what are you talking about? If you still have a DS, it's always DS days. <laughs> An old movie poster. Ah, thank you, Diego Gonzalez, for the sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You get to be on the witness stand while you sub today. <laughs> Apparently, this is the first movie that made Mia cry when she saw it. I'll have to check it out one of these days. Is it on the shelf, maybe, one of the keys? Oh, probably. All the cases the chief ever worked on are filed here. They're in alphabetical order. Let's take a look. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that button. I bonked it on the desk while I was spinning. <laughs> I'm still spinning. I am still spinning. I'm sorry. <laughs> They're in alphabetical order. Let's take a look. I don't know where the energy is coming from today, but there's too much. <laughs> Which files did I look at? I think A to I, because this should have DL6, right? Let's see if there's A. Ah record in this file that catches my eye. <laughs> you get it? Ah, uh, record that catches my eye. You get it? You get it? <laughs> A, B, F, Misty Fay. That's Mia and Maya's mother. Hmm, I should take a look. Should I take a look? Yeah, baby. I have tarnished the Faye name, leaving only these words. My mother vanished. I think someone killed her. I don't know. Actually, I do know what happens, kind of, because of later, so never mind. <laughs> I just made a bullshit guess, but I know what actually happens. <laughs> Tam, are we the defendant? I don't know. I just laid it up according to what looks nice, okay? <laughs> I didn't think it through. I'm on the wrong side. Shut up. <laughs> I, I can be what I want. Maybe it's mirrored. Maybe it's mirrored. <laughs> okay. It's the first ace attorney, but the second piece. I was determined to find the one who had made my mother blame herself in this way. Even the power that runs in my family, I held an audience with the dead. And finally, the names... Oh, that's supposed to be Mia's voice. <gasps> Finally, the names of two men surfaced. One was Marvin Grossberg, a lawyer who sold my mother's information for riches. He is asshole. And the other was the man who sold that information to the press. This parasite who makes his fortune on threats and coercion. His name is... Oh, the record stops there. He tore his name out. He's like, you can't read that. <laughs> Okay, so what's the protocol for backseating? Well, I've already played this whole game before, so I don't particularly care in this game. I don't, don't, don't spoil um, Investigations 2 or Daigek Tenzaiban, um, Great Ace Attorney Chronicles. For those ones, don't say anything. But for this particular game, it's not really so much backseating, because I mean, I've already beat the game. <laughs> if I forget, I forget stuff. Like, I've already beaten it myself once. I don't have anything to prove. <laughs> Yeah, Mia needs a sexy voice only. Not natural voice, only sexy voice. <laughs> so Mia knew Grossberg. I, I would probably be good to still avoid spoilers for this game though, at least, um, cause some people in chat may not have played the game before. Um, so I would be careful about that, but I might end up saying some spoilers. Oh, I can investigate that again. Mm, 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 mm,
<laughs> See J through S. Nothing much in here. Maybe I'll skim some of this. Bah. Well, no harm in flipping through a bit, I guess. The biggest part here at the end in S. A suicide? Oi. She has a collection of suicide reports. There's politicians, policemen. You remember the song I just sang? I wonder, I wonder what this has to do with. Oh yeah, oh yeah! There's writing on most of these in pencil. What? This is Mia's handwriting. Wait, I get it! Mia thought he was involved in these suicides. In these uh, suicides. <laughs> we got D is for de blackmail. <laughs> White drove them all to. I can use these newspaper clippings. We got them. Hmm, let's find the most disturbing one. A newspaper clipping added to the court record. What is the most disturbing one? Oh, it doesn't tell me. <laughs> That's disappointing. Oh, wait, I don't wanna look. I don't wanna look at the last one. It doesn't matter. It's not important. I'm gonna show you what I just found, buddy. I'm gonna show you what I just found, buddy. <laughs> There's an Ace Attorney esque spin off. Is, are you talking about um, 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 Aviary Attorney? Or, or do you mean the Die Gakuten that was an April Fool's joke where Eddie turned everyone into dogs? <laughs> Red White, as I expected. Well, if you wanted to challenge him, you could present this in court. Not a bad idea. That's what I'm gonna do, my friend. Oh, I guess I can't talk to him anymore. I guess I wasn't supposed to go here. Am I supposed to talk to Maya? Maya? Or go back to Red White? Oh, I think I'm supposed to go to Red White and get electrocuted. Let's get electrocuted. I guess. Look at that electric smile. Are you guys ready to be electrocuted? <laughs> I, hope, I hope it'll be a very shocking and enlightening experience for you. Don't mess with Pam because Pam's a CEO with a taser as well. I can also electrocute you. <laughs> well, aren't you persistent? Sorry, but there's something I have to ask you. Mr. Lawyer. He has a punchable face. He has a kissable face. I really hate having to repeat myself. But it seems the message has not yet penetrated your thick skull. Stop bothering me. If you try my patience further, I fear a nasty incident may occur. That was going to be a nasty incident for you, bud. Do I make myself clear? Yes, but I want some apple before we get electrocuted. Let's hope the chat is ground type. We can hope. <laughs> oh, yum, yum. That's the apple. Yeah, for a busy guy, he does a lot of standing around. I'm transparent. <laughs> I think we're past needing to talk about April May. But I always want to talk about April May. It's just my life. I gotta put the sky on the spot and quick. I don't have the tampon to show him right now, unfortunately. What's the matter? You seem distressed. Little mogul. 
So this guy's kind of a pro at pulling the wool over people's eyes. I gotta put him on the spot and quick. Stop that. Your hot gaze is giving me goose burns. Maybe he can be my lover then if he's not Roseburg. <laughs> I think he's hitting on me. You know, the only thing that would make this guy more sexy is put cat ears on him. <laughs> and cat ear red white, baby. He can help me blackmail all my rivals. I gotta show him the newspaper clipping, and then he's gonna fucking electrocute me. <laughs> Button. Oh, it's not ready yet. Is your I love your voice acting for Red White. Thank you. I I, I try really hard to make him sound as sexy as he looks. <laughs> oh, you're right. I could use the PNG. Let's see what that looks like real quick before we continue. <laughs> Satisfy my morbid, my, my morbid, <laughs> morbid curiosity. My mor, my morbid curiosity. <laughs> it's blue for blue corp. It's blue for blue corp. He's like, like yeah. <laughs> that is wow. That is wow. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> oh, what's wrong? Is something stuck to my face? More like I put it on your head. Why, yes, there's my eyes and my nose and my mouth. Blah. But of course, I jest. You need not refrain your mirth, my friends. <laughs> Sky is literally the biggest piece of shit. It's okay to indulge in my cosmopolitan sense of humor. I will not think less of you. I guess I gotta just show him the evidence. How you like this? It's the only clue that Mia left me. I better make this one count. Mr. White, see this? It's an article describing the suicide of a politician. Bezzling secret government funds. Then, one day, word got leaked to the press. The very next day, he took his own life. Doesn't sound like coincidence to me. And this, con and this concerns me how. <laughs> I found this article in Mia's office. Miss Mia? She had a file filled with articles like this. So even if you steal this one, I got more. I got more. I got a lot more where this came from. Every one of them was labeled with a single word. White. Mr. White, I know what you did to the politician. You spied on him, you bribed him, no, you blackmailed him. <laughs> you were blackmailing him. Blackmail? And not just him either. They were threatening and coercing hundreds of others. Yeah, Red Wife's king of the jungle. Or must be small jungle nods of all of Japan, California, actually. He's got the whole legal system under his thumb. Uh, maybe don't tell him there's a folder of him in her office. <laughs> I mean, that it is a mistake. That's why we get electrocuted, yeah? Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> You were involved in all of the suicide cases that Mia investigated. That's why you killed her. <laughs> this company is built on blackmail. Thanks, John Knight. Well, for the sub, thank you. I'm right, aren't I? What a bizarre accusation. Mr. Wrong. 
What is it now that you should be doing? Investigated. What is it that you should be doing now? Investigating me? He would be the type to say something like, I don't blackmail or white mail or something. <laughs> or like, I don't use threats, I use vague suggestions. <laughs> he would, he would, he would. No, 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 I think not. I think I missed a line. You should be searching for the one who killed Miss Mia. Thank you. Damn, I'll check for this up. Secretary's office. Hello? Mr. Wrong will be leaving now. Yes, sir. I'll send someone right away. Wait a second, Mr. White! You're wrong! You're wrong, Mr. White. Excuse me? What I should be doing now is going after you. Just what are you insinuating? Argument time. <laughs> Mia was on to you. She was keeping tabs. For this reason, you had April May tapping her phone. Yeah, she's tap, tap, tapping on that phone. Then Mia was murdered, and all the documents about you mysteriously disappeared. It was a big mystery. We can never, ever, 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 ever guess what happened to them. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This whole scene's just, you're wrong. No, you, no, you, no, you, no, you, no, you, no, you. <laughs> so, the culprit would be... Even a child could work it out, Mr. White. You did it. <laughs> Secretary's office. We won't be needing an escort for Mr. Wrong. Uh oh. Instead, please connect me to the public prosecutor's office. Of course, sir. One moment, please. I am. Uh... White? That you? What are you doing? Oh, that's Lana. <gasps> White? That you? What are you doing calling me at a time like this? Hello, Chief Prosecutor. I've changed my mind. I want to testify tomorrow. What's this about? The Mia Faye case. I witnessed the murder, you see. Oh, really? And thus, as a very important witness, I would like to testify. What? Why now? I thought you said you didn't want to go to court. Because <laughs> you got some stuff to hide. You got some stuff to hide. Yeah, I want whatever toothpaste he uses too. That's one shiny smile. Shiny teeth at me. Shiny teeth, shiny teeth. Shiny teeth, shiny teeth. Quiet you! I told you I changed my mind, didn't I? Oh, and one other thing. Send the police over here right away. The man standing right in front of me he looks dazed, but could be violent. What, what man? Are you even listening? The executioner, the hatchet man, the liquidator, the killer man. What? I didn't do it. What the fuck? <laughs> Mr. White, isn't another one of those? Chief prosecutor. I do not believe you are in a position to freely offer your opinions to me, correct? I'm telling you to send the police. Now. Aya, aya. Aya, aya. We get electrocuted. We get electrocuted. Did I not tell you, Mr. Wrong? You are a mere lawyer. As was Miss Mia. <gasps> dare you you kill my wife and then you do me dirty like this and then you rub it in my face oh you're going down and i'm stealing your table i'll point the finger at you and you will be tried as miss mia's killer the case is as good as settled no lawyer of any worth will defend you i defend myself I have friends in the local lawyers association, you see. You will be given a lawyer so stupendously 
the nips as they make even you look incompetent. I have the perfect win record, sir. A perfect win record, sir. <laughs> Good luck with that. I, 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 I feel faint. I feel faint. I feel faint. Yeah, I need my man. Where's Edgy when I need him? Oh, here we go. <laughs> Detective Gumshoe for Porton, sir. Uh, butts. Harry Butts! The favorite Harry Butt of all the Harry Butts. It's you! Right, right, ac right, actually, right, Phoenix, right? And, but, but my friend's name is Larry. Like, I've told you a million times, his name is Larry. Yeah. Oh, right. Sorry, pal. Butts was that murderer, right? No, he's my friend. He's my friend. Detective Gumshoe, I present to you the man who killed Miss Mia Fay. Are you not gonna believe you? Wh what? <laughs> Take this despicable human being into custody. Oh. Farewell, Mr. Wrong. Oh wait, maybe we got electrocuted. Uh, oh wait, we don't get electrocuted in this case, do we? I'm stupid. <laughs> that happens later, I think. Anyway, we're in the... We're... Yeah. I can't believe it's only been a day since the first trial. Yeah. It, it's really amazing how fast you have to investigate in this. No wonder... No wonder so many innocent people are framed. <laughs> no, Maya's not dead. Mia's dead. Mia's dead. Maya's not dead. <laughs> My trial begins tomorrow. White's going to set a trap for me, obviously. And the prosecution will be in on it, of course. <laughs> Edgeworth included. Ed mm, I don't know. Do you guys really think Edgeworth would believe the trap? I think I, I trust my husband. I trust that Edgeworth would believe enough in me that he can see through this bullshit. Yeah, I, I, th I know for sure someone else electrocutes later on. But for some reason, I thought White also did. But I guess I was wrong. He just, like, threatens and removes you. <laughs> Not gonna be electrocuted today, my dudes. An attorney was assigned to me by the state yesterday. I refused, of course. I had an idea. I'm gonna do it myself. Right! <gasps> Mr. Right! Oh, Maya. <laughs> oh, great. They let you out of detention. Just now, yes. It's all thanks to you. Uh, now I'm afraid we switched places. <laughs> maybe Maya can be my lawyer. Maybe. No, Mia. Mia's dead. <laughs> Mia. Mia is the victim in this case. What? You mean you? Yeah. I mean I. Yeah. I mean I. I definitely I. I explained what happened to Maya. It. How many people does that man need to destroy before he's satisfied? My mother, my sister, and now you. This has gone too far! Mr. Bright, please tell me, is there anything I can do? Be by my side. Be by my side. Um, defend me in court, Maya. <laughs> Imagine how that would go. I'm gonna break out of here. We're gonna prison break. This is now prison break the game. We're gonna bust out of jail, guys. Oh my god. Should we bust out of jail? Should we bust out of jail? Bust out of jail. It'd be the fastest way to fix this. <laughs> right, okay. Listen up. I want you to help me break out of here. Do you mean a jailbreak? Yeah. Tonight's our only chance. <laughs> Alright. Uh, that was a joke, Maya. Oh, I better go get a hacksaw, but the stores are still open. I have a boot platter and a gateway getaway car. Uh, can you drive? I was kidding. 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. What, what, what? I'm getting ill joke. <laughs> exactly. But that's illegal. <laughs> no way! And though really I was getting but thanks, it's good to know you're on my side. <laughs> and there really isn't anything you can do for me anyway. But, but, but I can't just sit here and do nothing. I've got to give the man a piece of my mind. Just a piece? <laughs> okay. Then come to the trial tomorrow. Okay, I'll be there. I'll show them a thing or two. Yeah, let's wreck them. The policeman has to wreck them. <laughs> yeah. Times may change. Yet with crime, it's the same old story. In fact, it's gotten worse. Lengthy court proceedings are no longer realistic. Beginning a few years ago, a limit of three days was put on initial court trials. Japanifornia law sucks. Almost all finish in a day, most with a guilty verdict. Because you don't get some time to get any evidence. I never thought I would end up in the defendant's chair myself for this case. <laughs> with the true culprit appearing as the star witness. <laughs> and this is it. Tomorrow it's me or him. I'm gonna take this piece of shit down. To be continued. Stream over. Why? We got to to be continued. To be continued. To be continued. One sec. Uh uh uh. Let me save. It's the next morning. It's the morning after. I leave the explosives at home, my. <laughs> if he brought, if she brought them, we might get in trouble. Well, I guess this is it. Yeah. One way or another, this case gets decided today. I've been unrelated, but did you see the new images for Danganronpa Decade and Spassky being the beach? The beach images? Yeah, I saw the beach images. <laughs> you ever play Ghost Trick? Yeah, I love Ghost Trick. And it's one of my favorite soundtracks of all time. The game was really unique. I really liked it. Ah! This is Phoenix! Look! I am. Prosecutor. Altor. I received a call from the chief prosecutor's office yesterday. I was told that whatever Mr. White says today, it will be the absolute truth. What? What? What bullshit is this? <laughs> no matter how you try to attack his testimony, if I raise an objection, I have it on good faith that the judge will listen to me. Oh, what? So I got the judge in his pocket, too? <laughs> Yeah, now kiss. Just in case I don't get it, just in case I get a guilty verdict and get executed, can we kiss now? <laughs> so, you're saying I'm gonna be guilty, end of story. Oh, that stare. I will do anything to get my verdict, Mr. Wright. Anything. Even send your husband to jail? Why? Why? Torment an innocent person like this! Innocent. How can we know that? I mean, it's pretty obvious I didn't do it. <laughs> you know me, buddy. You know me, buddy. I don't mean that. The guilty will always lie to avoid being found out. There's no way to tell who is guilty and who is innocent. I mean, you could just believe your friend. I'm your friend. I'm your friend. You never kill in my life. Never kill in my life. Please believe me. <laughs> you know. All that I can hope to do is get every defendant declared guilty. You know who would look better with cat ears? Ezra. <laughs> 
more than red white. They suit him more than red white. <laughs> Cause he's he's a cinder, therefore he's a cat, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe if I wear the cat ears, I won't get a guilty verdict. Because everyone, everyone trusts, everyone trusts cats. There, now I'm obviously innocent. It's fine. All that I can hope to do is get every defendant declared guilty. So I make that my policy. As well. You change. You changed. You weren't. It wasn't always like this. It wasn't always like this. Huh? Phoenix, you know him? <laughs> Don't expect any special treatment, Phoenix. Right? Phoenix. Well, <laughs> and Coral will be starting soon. What? But wait! Your defense attorney isn't even here yet! They're not. I'll be defending myself. I don't. We have an attorney yet, meow. <laughs> I don't need no attorney. What? Okay, let's do this. Maya is traumatized by me. Okay, it's like what, five minutes later? You're now in session for the trial, Mr. Felix, right? You. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Miss Mr. Roy, are you sure you're up to doing this? Yes, Your Honor. I'll be defending myself. <laughs> Yeah, Nyan lawyers don't pass the bar, they pass the pulse. <laughs> Understood. I, I'm still a legit lawyer. I know I might look like a cat, but I'm, I'm a lawyer. I'm, hold it, hold it. I'm still a lawyer. You gotta believe me. <laughs> Very well, Mr. Edgeworth, your opening statement, please. Oh, that's, that's Edward. As the details of the event are already quite clear to the court, today we will hear the testimony of a witness to the defendant's crime. I see. Well, prosecution may call its witness. That went far too smoothly. <laughs> yeah, if you can wear these hairstyles to court, you can totally wear cat ears. Me totally. Oh, I didn't test it on Phoenix. It matches his suit. It matches his suit. <laughs> I think the cat ears would look cutest on Maya, though, you're saying. why his witness didn't testify before. I mean, it seems like something you'd normally ask. <laughs> it's like, it's like he already knows why. If anyone's going to raise an objection about this, I suppose it's me. Mr. Edgeworth, you owe an explanation to the court. Why didn't this witness testify in the trial against this Maya Faye? <sighs> Yaddy. I'm ever so sorry. Mr. White is a busy man, and besides, at the time I thought that Miss May's opinion was all that would be needed. Again, my sincerest apologies to the court, to the court, <gasps> to the court. <laughs> I know how to win this case, boot to the head, yeah, yeah, baby. Let's die, Gakuten Saiban, the guy that objects with his foot. <laughs> Excellent, Mr. Edgeworth, I appreciate your demeanor. <laughs> yes. 
great. I get to show off and I get nowhere. <laughs> I would like to call Mr. Red White to the stand. Please state your full name. You wish to know the title of my personage? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to know the title of your personage. Uh, your name, please. Just, just, just your name. Please, I want to get out of here and go home. Just your name. Yes, that is what I said. The boss, I'm ready to testify against Red. Cool, thanks. Be on standby. I'll need you soon. Oh, dear. Do my locutions confuse? Name. <laughs> These two are great together. I ship them. My name is Red White, but my friends call me Blanco, you know. <laughs> I am the CEO, or to use a more common term, the president of Blue Cool. I think we know what it means either way. I see that he really likes to talk about himself. <laughs> Did you know the victim, Miss Miofe? That would be a negatory. No, I did not. <laughs> Already lying. Yeah, you should do toothpaste commercials. You were at the Gatewater Hotel the night of the murder? Correct. And you witnessed the murder from there? Uh, why tell what you already know? Very well, Mr. White, you may begin your testimony. If I can't rip this guy's testimony apart, I'm gonna rip his face apart. I'm done for. <laughs> Why do I always feel like it's the end of the world and I'm the last man standing? <laughs> oh. Ah, uh, speckly shiny. I hope you have made your peace with God, Mr. Lawyer. I'm gonna let him have it. I'm gonna tear him a new one. <laughs> Let's see, it was about nine, I believe. I was quietly crucifying. That's rude to you. Some papers by the window. Then I heard a bedlam coming from outside. Surprised, I turned to look at the building across the way. It was then I saw him, a spiky-haired man attacking a woman with long hair. Needless to say, the man was none other than you, Mr. Lawyer. Excuse me, my hairstyle is not Evans alone. Anyone could do this hairstyle. I called Miss May over at once. She too was flabbergasted, of course. Then why did May mention you? <laughs> the victim, she... She ran away, but you gave chase. Finally, there was a terrible impaction. Then it was all over. I want some apple before we tear this testimony to shreds. The sneaks occurred as you justifiable brain, the defendant is guilty. Very well, defendant, I mean, Mr. Wright, you cross examination. Yes, Your Honor. I don't actually remember this one. I think I'm gonna press because I don't think I have any good evidence to show. Hmm. 
dodge and ran to the right. Oh, maybe that one. Maybe that one. I don't think ran away, it just says dodged. So maybe that one? I played this before, but it was a long time ago. <laughs> Let's see if I got it. It's probably wrong, that's okay. wrong. I gotta press that, maybe. Yeah, I just gonna press. <laughs> and running away and dodging are two different things. Running away and dodging are two different things. <laughs> this technically should have counted. That's okay. I have a lot of penalties in this version. I'm trying to scroll all the way back. Pressing op opens options. I just thought that one might be it, and I didn't want to waste time in case that was it. Yeah, I always press every option. The only thing is that takes a lot of time to do while streaming, so I was gonna try to avoid it. <laughs> Hold it! Oh, my cat ears are. Hold on. There. <laughs> How do you know what time it was? Because I am always absolutely perfect, you know? <laughs> He's the most arrogant person I've ever seen. No, 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 you're not getting away with that. You are so mistrusting, Mr. Lawyer. So, what was the proper term for secretary again? Anyway, Miss May ordered room service for nine. It happened soon after room service arrived. Oh, that's what Miss May said, too. <laughs> True, the bellboy who brought the coffee saw Miss May. But he testified that he didn't see you at the time. Uh, this is your concern? That's a big fucking concern. <laughs> Still, lawyer, Miss May received the coffee outside the room. Of course, he could not see me. He would need x-ray vision to pull off something like that. Shoot, that's true. Now tell us what you were doing at the time. I think the autopsy report matched what he said, though, right? Because the autopsy report was, like, struck. I can't check it without presenting it. Oh, I dodged an attack and ran to the right. Yeah, oh, ran. I thought it said dodged to the right. In Turnabout Musical, it says dodged to the right. I was thinking of the song, not the wording in the game. Oops. <laughs> it was correct in the game. <laughs> Hold it! Uh, bed, 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 look? It must have been when you attacked, I assume. Wish, continue. Surprised, I turned to look at the building across the way. It was then I saw you. Oh. I gotta, I got, I got, I gotta go back. Oh, I pressed hold again. <gasps> Spiky haired. Needless to say, that man was none other than you, Mr. Lawyer. Hold it! That wasn't the autopsy report? Was I looking at the wrong thing? Oh, you're right, this is the autopsy report. <laughs> <laughs> may have lived for a few minutes, hit by a blunt object. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it matches, but I'll check. <laughs> and what you said just directly conflicts with Miss May's testimony. Miss May clearly stated that the assailant looked like a girl. I've always been proud of my eyesight, Mr. Lawyer. And just what is your eyesight? Sparkly. 
counting both eyes. Forty. Forty, <laughs> you don't add them together. Oh, uh, I think the witness is trying to say his eyesight is good. Yep. Hey, we sighted some Tajan anyway. And what did you do then? I called Miss May over at once. She too was surprised, of course. Um, let me see. October Impactional. Yeah, see, that still matches. Um. Hold it. What was Miss May doing at the time? She had just finished watching a soap opera on the TV and was weeping openly. He's impartial, right? No, he's fucking not. <laughs> and did you know she had been tapping the Fey office phone? Objection. Irrelevant! That has nothing to do with the case at hand. I think it has everything to do with it personally. I care not. I will answer the lawyer's bold inquiry. Miss May was acting alone when she tapped the phone of this Fey woman. You'd make a good politician, Mr. White. Oh, I know. After all, I am El President. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Please continue. Just shut up, man. Um, 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 um. Hold it. Uh, can you be a little more detailed about that? <laughs> I think it's worth knowing exactly what happened. Of course, comprehend. I understand. The victim was attacked by you and ran to the left. <laughs> then she dodged the right. You gave chase and struck her down. Are you sure? Ah, uh, spark, spark, spark. As you know, I always act so positively perfect. <laughs> Perhaps you should change your testimony to reflect this new detail. Yeah, he's very modest. Ran to the left, I don't fucking think so. Hey, my May's testimony is wrong. Objection! Wait, right there! Mr. White, you've dug your own grave. What is this? You said the victim ran to the left. I mean, people do mix up left and right a lot, so I wouldn't hold this one. <laughs> but that directly contradicts Miss May's testimony. She clearly stated that she saw the victim ran right. Oh, 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 it is simple. You have misheard her. I don't think so. <laughs> I think not. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I brought something today. I brought something today. I can slap the paper. Bam, baby. <laughs> Look at... Okay, no. Look at the floor plan. killer was here and the victim here if the victim ran to the left as you claim she did she would have been running directly away from the door don't you really be stupid <laughs> she would have been running into a, she would have been running into a dead end i mean in your panic i kind of understand but <laughs> It. We broke red white. <laughs> I had that sexy face now. I his nose looks like garlic. <laughs> Very strange. I did not see her run to the left. I, I did see her run to the left. I did. 
hope that isn't an important work document. Um, <laughs> actually, it is. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, James. <laughs> it, 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 it's a company contract. from a different perspective. He was in the office murdering. True. Maybe he really did see the victim run to the left. So he did witness the killing? Wait a second. Got him, baby. Miss Roy? Yes, Your Honor. Miss May says right and Mr. White says left. Can you explain this contradiction to the court? They're both right, baby. Both witnesses are telling the truth. For once. <laughs> yeah, Maya is the waifu. Maya is laifu. <sighs> yada yada. Huh. I doubt it. Rather, that does not clear up the contradiction. There is one scenario that would explain their conflicting accounts. What? Oh yeah, I, I also got this. I could bang something today, I made space. Obviously the witness was not viewing the crime from the hotel. Mr. Wright, what do you mean? Yes, what do you mean? He was not viewing the crime from the hotel. Oh, wait, that's Ezra's. I don't need to bang anything. If he was not in the hotel... Oh, that's Ezra's. <gasps> that was the worst I ever did. I messed up. <laughs> if he was not in the hotel, where could he have been? In the law offices. Of Bay and Co., of course. da na 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 we now, are, we now have these sponsored messages, aka Pam's getting Apple and swapping teas. Give me a second. <laughs> this this stream is brought to you by Take That Incorporated. Oh no, I'm doing the happy cycle laugh. <laughs> yeah, it's a low PNG, take that. It's just like a PNG thumbnail. <laughs> I figured I'd show it so briefly it didn't matter, but then I guess I showed it a long time. Yeah, it's no blow singing. <laughs> he's watching the stream, but he's not able to chat today because I gave him a massive task. <laughs> he is suffering and slaving away with music stuff. More specific 
Technically, he was standing here. Um, <laughs> time to show the court where Mr. White was standing. He was the victim. The true victim all along was Red White. This whole trial was a fucking farce. He's dead. But this is Mia in cosplay. That's why that's why it's been so gorgeous. And why his personality's been a little wonky. Because um he's trying to convince us that he's red white, but he's actually Mia Fay. <laughs> I think he was he was he was the window. where he was. Look. Mm. When the victim ran for the door, if he was watching from this point to him, it would appear that she ran left. Please, this is no time for jokes in ill taste. That is where the killer was standing. Yeah, he's actually Charlie. The tree was red white. <laughs> Charlie was the killer. It wasn't red white. The killer was Charlie. We forgot there was a whole being in that room. Oh my God, Charlie's the killer. It's so clear to me now. Holy shit. We've been on the wrong track, guys. I think a lot of people have played Clue. <laughs> you know, there's a digital version of Clue, I believe, on Steam now, too. You can play Clue online if you don't have a physical copy with, like, people online and stuff. I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, Charlie Bitter. Order! I will have order! Anyone disturbing the order in this courtroom will be held in contempt. Mr. Wright, what are you suggesting? R -r -rap scallion <laughs> Alpha. The postulations of the defense are a distortion of the truth, Your Honor. Edgeworth, my bro! What you doing there? What you doing there? I mean, as, um, oh, what's her face? I want to say Scarlet, but I'm not sure if that's correct or if it's because I was reading a webtoon where one of the main characters is called Scarlet. <laughs> I think so. I think that's who I usually play as. Indeed, they do seem to be a bit far-fetched. Oh, oh, oh. You provide us with so much entertainment, Mr. Lawyer. What now? He's laughing. The hilarity of the moment made me remember something. Oh, Scarlet's right, thank God. <gasps> it appears I have been unclear, and for this I apologize. Mr. Your Honor. Mr. Your Honor. <laughs> It says Mr. Your Honor. That's so stupid. <laughs> oh, whatever. This is Simpsons version. Oh my god. You know what I've always wanted? I want to play a Danganronpa version of Clue. They do actually have a physical fan made version of Danganronpa Cluedo. But I want to play like a digital version so I can play a collab of Danganronpa Clue. <laughs> You know what would be cool? A pad mod. Where you can play as Clue, but it's in the warehouse. Oh man, that would be badass. You gotta figure out who killed me every time. <laughs> he thinks he's really smart, but he's not. Yeah, that's every CEO except me. I'm an actual genius. I'm an actual genius. I don't just think I'm smart. I am smart. I'm an exception. I'm the best of the best ever. I am, I am superior even among CEOs. Clue with numbers could be really fun sometime, maybe. I'll keep that in mind. I would quite enjoy that, I think. <laughs> and we'd only be able to have a certain amount of numbers join, though. But I, if the games are fast enough, we could do a few rounds. And I guess, actually, I know only a certain number of people join each game anyway, so it's probably fine. <laughs> oh, they're the same game? Okay, I thought maybe Cluedo was, like, um, the name they give to mods. 
and found ones to avoid copyright. Because <laughs> I've only seen Cluedo used for like, um, 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 um fan made ones. It's Cluedo, all. You know what? It's Cluedo to me. It's Cluedo to me. <laughs> Might I be allowed to testify once more? No. Very well, let's hear your revised testimony. <laughs> Good luck, you can't fix a broken testimony, buddy. Miss May's testimony was correct, as was mine. When you assaulted the girl, she first ran to the left. And then you hit her savagely. That is what I saw. Next, with the last of her strength, she ran to the right. You chased her and delivered the final blow. <laughs> mm. Wasn't there only one blow? That is what Miss May saw. You see, you hit her twice. Don't you remember, Mr. Lawyer? I don't think so. Shut up! It's like tomato, tomato. It can be Cluedo if I want it to, okay? <laughs> well, that does make sense. No, it doesn't, you idiot. This judge is stupid. I'd make a better judge than this guy. <laughs> it has Clue in the name, but it also looks like Cluedo! <laughs> Stop judging me. Will you be cross-examining the witness's testimony? Yeah. You bet I will! I mean, yes, Your Honor. <laughs> yeah, I've spoken. It's Cluedo now. She ran to the left. That's the name of this testimony. She ran to the bottom left. Because April May lives on the bottom left with me. No, I'm not bottom left. I'm not bottom left. I'm top right. Top right say so, VTuber. You guys can't prove otherwise. You have no evidence. No evidence against me. Top right, perfectly say so, VTuber. There's not a single shred of evidence that proves that statement is incorrect. Miss Ma Oh wait, I don't need to redo all that. Um aside from by Ablo. So I feel like that's probably it, but I kinda wanna hold just in case. Just in case. All that. What do you mean by that? That is what I am about to explain. See, Joey gets it. Joey gets it. Top right VTuber. Top right VTuber. Everyone else is trying to frame me. Everyone else is trying to frame me. Joey gets it. Joey's on my side. Joey's on my side. <laughs> You Americans are always so impatient. It does not become you. Hey, buddy, you're an American too. Yeah, we're all in Japan and Fornia here. When you assaulted the girl, she first ran to the left. And then you... Oh, uh, that was... The... Ah! There we go. What do you mean first? First, that is what comes before what happens next. You do speak English, right? Please, sit back, relax. I will try to use simple words for your benefit. <laughs> first, she ran to the left and then... Oh, my husband doesn't believe me, oh no. 
the prosecution requests that the defense refrain from interrupting the testimony. Miss Wright, you have been warned! Show us proof. Yeah, we're doing it cloudy style. Blah! Can I do nothing right? I do everything right. Everything right. These guys are being unfair. May I continue? Come on, I'm Caddyers. Believe me, I'm cute. I'm cute. You guys agree, right? If I'm cute, that means I'm innocent. Definitely, right? I'm too cute to be guilty. I'm too cute to be guilty. That is what Miss May saw. I'm too cute to be guilty. So each of you saw different parts. Oh, so positively. That's right, of course. Where did he pick up that annoying phrase? I love it. I love the way Red White speaks. It's so funny. Yeah, cute as justice. I'm correct. I am the law. Exactly, just like how Miss May is innocent. We're both innocent. Anyway, moving along. Oh, oh man, he did not hit her twice. So you were watching both times? I suppose I was. And please excuse me for not testifying to this sooner. What do you think, Phoenix? You guys requested Caddy or Maya. They get angry, Caddy or Maya. Angie, Caddy or Maya. I think it'd be cute if she's in a pose where maybe it fit on her head a little better. <laughs> I think it looks better on me though, because it matches my sweater. Yeah. Oh, I think we got him right where we want him. He slipped. Let him, ha let him laugh for now. I'll soon wipe that smile off his face. Miss May's testimony was correct. Oh, I've got to go back. So, Eddie, you have to show the evidence. Uh, I think it's this one's probably the most likely. But, um, Ablo, Ablo, Ablo. One, one, one. Single blow, single blow, single blow. <laughs> single blow only. Single blow only. Single blow only. Objection! <laughs> Mr. White, you're not fired if you say Maya's cuter than the boss because I agree, Maya is really cute. Okay, okay, this is a little bit of a confession. Do you guys know Eda Bags? Eda Bags, where you collect all those pins and keychains and stuff for your favorite characters. I have three Eda Bags. I have three Eda Bags. Only three Eda Bags. One Eda Bag? Is a bunch of Maya Fey merch. The other Eda bag is a bunch of a bunch, a bunch of Francesca merch. And my other Eda bag is every other Ace Attorney character. Just I didn't have enough to make a bag for them. And you don't even understand the rare stuff I have in that one. I have a pin of old bag. I literally have a pin of old bag. I treasure it. I treasure it so damn hard. And it's even um space helmet old bag. <laughs> 
It's incredible. I, I, I love this series. You don't understand. I live for this damn series. <laughs> Ace Attorney is my life. It's just my whole life, basically. <laughs> I have... It's somewhere... I don't remember the exact number. I have... I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I have somewhere between 15 and 20 Ace Attorney cosplays. And I made almost all of them. I'm not kidding. I have... I, I literally have in the room that I'm streaming in a Steel Samurai helmet that I made. <laughs> I made it out of paper mache. Like, um, a balloon. But, um, <laughs> I didn't... I didn't ever make paper mache in my life before I tried making the Steel Samurai helmet. Um, so I, I fucked up really bad, really bad, and I used whole wheat flour the first time, and it never dried. It just went soggy and moldy overnight, and I was like, no! <laughs> it was, it was really scary. It was really scary. <laughs> I was like traumatized from paper mache. Um, you did see me cosplay. Remember in the Shadows House song cover, I cosplayed, um, Emiliko. <laughs> you did. You saw in that one, yeah? You saw in that one. You saw in that one. <laughs> Mr. White. Oh, I forgot it's apple time. I missed it. Actually, give me a second. I gotta pee. I was trying to hold off, but I really drank a lot today because this game is very voice intensive. I drink a lot more than usual. And, uh, yeah. Uh, I really gotta pee. So I'm gonna be back. You can listen to my intro song again. Because it's still relevant. <laughs> I still have Steel Samurai as my ringtone. <laughs> I'll be back. Red White makes the rules. Red White rolls the dice. Red White's got the purse. Red White makes the rules. Red White rolls the dice. Red White's got the personality that makes everyone look twice. Red White draws the lines. Red White deals the cards. People stop me everywhere to betrust me their regard. But Red's a decent man with old fashioned ideals. Red will answer just one question, cause that's just how nice he feels. Well, okay, Mr. White, fine. If Blue Corp isn't for blackmail, what does it do exactly? Uh huh, Blue Corp, my labor of love, my pride and prejudice. Blue Corp deals in information we buy and sell it to. You may not know that Blue Corp was named for the color blue. Caught it up myself. Mm. Red White gets the best. Red White follows through. Ask not what you can do for Red, but what Red can do for you. And what can Red White do for you, Monsignor? I'll count that last question as a practice. And now, here's your only chance. Make it worthwhile. Okay, Mr. White. Fine. There's one last thing I wanted to know. Who'd you take that statue from? Take? How dare you accusify me of something like that? This is a Paris original straight from Canada. Speaking of, I bet you've never been to Canada. It's not far, in fact, just north from here. Go straight, you can't miss it. I especially love that mountain with the president. Oh, and that big tower that leans to the side. And you can oh, just take it from Senator no, Patrick can make you seem such a perhaps. <laughs> I'm not familiar with the title of his personage. He's a politician who killed himself. I think I know his name. He was caught embezzling government funds. <laughs> that really is a shame. And then one day, the press got wind of it. Are you quite finished now? And the day after, he killed himself. <laughs> this concerns me how. Me, they knew about your operation. Your blackmail has caused countless to die. Blue Corp's blackmailing thrives while you take hundreds of lives, but it stops right here. No more will you paralyze with fear. If 
have some pretty magnificent tasteless claims there, Mr. Wrong, was it? <laughs> but how does all this connect with me? Come now, make me laugh. Indulge me. <laughs> it's quite all right to exasperate my prodigal and cosmopolitan sense of humor. <laughs> Mia Fey found the connection. On this file is a list of suicides, all of them marked with the name White. <laughs> Mr. Wrong! <laughs> Why are you spending all this time investigating me? Shouldn't you be looking for the murderer of your dear Miss Fay? And just what do you think I'm doing, Mr. White? <sighs> you must have talked to Grody Bird, I guess he had to speak! Gross Ask speak. him why I have his painting, I'll tell you why he's weak! Only the strong survive, kid, and Red White's the alpha male! Red White's the king of the jungle, and that gross face, he's a whale. So don't you come here trying to kick me off my throne! Like he who is with sin and loves it, cast the final stone! <laughs> Connect me to the chief prosecutor's office, please, and, and call security. I have a raving madman on my hands! Yes, Mr. White? White, what do you want? This isn't a great time. I've decided I want to testify in tomorrow's trial. It seems the culprit was right here all along. I thought you said you didn't want anything to do with Quietude! I said I changed my mind now, didn't I? And don't I believe you're in any position to question me. You didn't! Yeah, Mr. Lawyer. What are you going to do? You don't understand, kid. I control the police. I control the prosecution. I control... The judge. I am the law. He who has the money has the control, Mr. Wrong. You're nothing but a mere lawyer. <laughs> Tell me if they was to. Red White breaks the rules. Red White loads the dice. Red White has the power. So take Red White's advice. Red White stacks the deck. Red White is always ahead. Ask not what red can do for you, but what you can do for red! <laughs> okay, back to destroying Red White. I'm sorry if that um, took a little longer than anticipated. I, don't, I meant to have the song play once. I don't know if I played once or twice. I had an incident with a spider near my computer. <gasps> be taken care of before I could that had to be taken care of before I could come back <laughs> I may or may not be a little panicked the rest of the stream because now I'm scared there's more spider <laughs> and you know a box is a really confined space to be stuck with a spider <laughs> So I'm just a little, just, just, just a little frazzled. I, I blew out my voice screaming my lungs out, so um, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> the VO might be a little toned down for the rest of this stream. I blew out my voice. Thank you, Father Crest, for the water while I was gone. You provided water so I could wash my hands. <laughs> and thank you, Lady Octopus, for joining. Yay, yay, yay. That's exciting. New friend. New friend. Oh, yeah. Look at you, you're the big sparkly apple. <laughs> oh, you had to join for the song? Thank you! It's it's by it's from Turnabout Musical. I'll be putting the credits for it in the description afterwards if you want to hear the original. I highly recommend it. I love all of Turnabout Musical. There's gonna be another song cover that you guys haven't heard yet at the end of the stream from Turnabout Musical as well. <laughs> Basically every Ace Attorney stream you can expect one or two Turnabout Musical songs relevant to the current part we're playing, I guess. <laughs> Maybe not for Die Get With End so on the stream though because, um, well, there's no musical for it. <laughs> Maybe I can do Cornered with a kazoo or something instead. <laughs> Ah, oh, you know Turnabout Musical. Nice, nice, nice! That makes me really happy. Not not many people know Turnabout Musical, but I live for it. It's like, it's so incredible. <laughs> I love it so much. I love it so much. Okay, here we go. Actually, no, we don't. Here, no. My dream role, I just want to quickly share. <laughs> my dream role is to be April May or Maya or Mia or Cody Hackins. 
in an actual like presentation of turnabout musical i'd actually like die i'd be so happy i'd probably just like cease to exist <laughs> okay <laughs> mr white the victim died from a single blow <laughs> what do you have to say to that got him wrong face <laughs> You ever just program your face, but you make the wrong expression and you're like, shit, I meant to make a different face. <laughs> Is April May still working at the warehouse? Of course, I mean, once Red goes in jail, she needs somewhere to work, right? <laughs> uh, and now is my chance to hit him where it counts. Gasp, Luder, scary. Mr. White. Wasn't it you who told this court you were absolutely perfect? <laughs> yeah, she doesn't work. She just kind of poses with boxes and stuff. <laughs> but it improves. It Im improves. It improves company morale, so it's fine. Everyone seems more productive with her around. Her and has Pando around. Man, everyone's real productive. Everyone's never late anymore. Everyone's always at work. <laughs> They don't want to leave. <laughs> but yeah, she, I guess she's actually in jail too. So maybe she doesn't work here anymore. This will be her last day. Say goodbye to April May, fellas. This is her last day. She's got to go to jail now. I'm a rich CEO though. I'll bail her out. It's fine. <gasps> it's fine. She'll be back tomorrow. I will refrain from using that phrase from now on. Your honor. If I could ask the witness for a new testimony. Objection. Ugh. The witness was obviously confused, Your Honor. I would like to request a 10 minute break. Yeah, yep. Why, yep. She may be an accomplice for murder, so it may be tricky. It's fine, it's fine. I've killed people before. I've killed people before, and look at me, I'm standing here. <laughs> I'll get her out. I got secrets. I got secrets. I got secrets. The witness is confused because he's lying. I am emph em emphatically, I think, emphatically request that there be no break, Your Honor. Yeah, this is you guys. This is you guys screaming for justice. Thank you, Pam, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Very well. If the witness would care to revise his testimony. Crowd's on my side, baby. No slipping out of this now, White. A slippery little snake, you. Mr. White? Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's you again. Oh, well, see, I looked at the other window when I heard that thing fall. Then the next moment, I saw Miss Mia run to the left. The killer, you, attacked her, but she dodged. Um, and then, she turned and ran for the door. Then he did her in with a single blow. Well. Yeah, he looks really, he's a little sweaty there. A little sus. Uh, black indeed. You. Very well. You may begin that cross examination. Mr. Your Honor. My stomach, you see, is hurting. No. Deal with it, bro. <laughs> it sucks to be you. Yeah, where did that charming smile go? He messed up, and he knows it. I want some apple. Give me one sec. Give me one sec. I got apple. Mm -mm -mm. I had to fix my cushion. It moved on my chair, and it was starting to sink down a bit. Now I can split my legs again. <laughs> I'm trying to spin around and kick my leg. I think I'm actually five. I 
Um, it's a good thing I don't have a 3D model because I'd be moving so much you guys would be annoyed. <laughs> Get some feet tracking. You'll just be distracted by my kicking feet the whole stream. Yeah, I kind of wonder too what style and what um hair product he uses to get his hair. My guess is that um, to be ice free spray. That's not just what a lot of cosplayers use on wigs, and I used it for my Athena Sykes wig, and I got her hair to hold. So I think I think probably that. <laughs> I also used it for Rafa's, but my Rafa wig didn't quite work out as much as I hoped. So. It didn't work in that case. <laughs> I'm using a pro controller this time, but it feels kind of pointless for this game. With visual novels, I like to use Joy-Cons, but I was lazy. <laughs> the pro controller was sitting here. <laughs> Deal with it! This is almost over. Goo. He's stressed. Stress. Don't worry, the demotion today is just that you get to sit there and watch. You get to be uninvolved. Everyone else got to be very involved by helping testify against White for me. It's very helpful. You know what? I should get my kazoo so I can play along with the BGM when I'm not needed to do anything. Okay, now I'm not even spinning. I'm literally bouncing on my chair. I'm like using my legs, swinging them for gravity and like bouncing. <laughs> energy, from what? From what energy? From what energy? Single blow. Phoenix! <gasps> He's getting a lot less talkative. He's probably afraid I'll catch on. Oh. He's probably afraid I'll catch on to something. But it won't be easy. I gotta do press, I think, here. Hold the horses, man. <gasps> you heard that thing fall. What exactly was that thing? Are your legs really that far from the floor? Like, I can reach them if I really stretch. My toes can touch the floor. And if I don't stretch, they don't reach it at all. Like, I'm swinging really, like, vigorously right now, and they're not hitting the floor. <laughs> uh, it, it sucks, but it's also great, because I never got to outgrow that phase of swinging your feet whenever you're in a chair. <laughs> if I sit on the front of the chair, usually my feet reach the ground. But if I sit in the back of the chair with my back against the back, like, you know, a, hum a normal human is supposed to, my legs don't reach the ground. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. <gasps> if I wear heels, my feet sometimes touch the floor. I can, like, jam the heels in. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. It's only because I was lazy and tired and didn't decide to shape shift bigger today. And I'm glad Pam is a little different. <laughs> Yeah, it might be too much energy left over from the Catboy stream. <laughs> it is a throne, by the way. Thanks for noticing. It's not a normal chair. It's a throne. So that might have something to do with why it's a little bit taller. Yeah? Because thrones do tend to be pretty big. I kind of forgot about that. I forgot that most people don't use a throne. Most people use a normal, like, boring old computer chair. But I'm using a throne. So I think that explains it, actually. That, I think, explains everything. Oh, that's how the glass light stands. <laughs> right, the one that had fallen over at the scene. <laughs> Phoenix! Does something about that strike you as odd? I don't remember what they said. <laughs> uh, uh, no, not really why. <laughs> Please continue your cross examination. I gotta... I gotta go back. <laughs> let's, let's, let's hold it again. That thing. Oh. Glass light stand. Hmm, I think it was broken. So that's not really weird, right? It fell towards her. It fell towards her. 
No. <laughs> Wait. <gasps> Could he have not seen that it was the light stand? <laughs> okay, no. The way it fell. He might have seen it. He might have seen it as it fell if it's over the window. I think that is one to go back to, possibly. I just don't remember which one it is in the end. Paul's right there, Missy. Miss Mia? Miss White, did you know the victim personally? Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. No, no, no. Triple no. How could I? How could I? He totally knows her. <laughs> I see nothing odd about the witness knowing the name of the victim. I love the sexy hand slam. Mm. Mr. Wright, I will not have you harrying the witness. You're looking a little flustered, boy. The oh, I already read this one. <laughs> She was hit before she ran. Yes, I, I must have been confused. Oh, I forgot to check some water away. But don't worry, we all know what happened now. Accusations. <laughs> oh, oh, right. Thank you, Miles. Oh, I think we'll blow. Thwap. Hold it. I want to hear the thwap again. <laughs> White is not a very White is not a very smart individual. I'm a much smarter CEO than he is. Thwap. That doesn't sound like the savage attack from your earlier testimony. It's like a whip, a little love thwap. Ho oh, ho! Oh, yes, well, I am a man of peace, you see. <laughs> peace, my ass. Phoenix! Oh, yeah, it was the thing at the beginning. I thought it might be, but I wasn't sure. That seemed too easy. I guess that was it. <laughs> but he could have technically seen it. A bit of the light would have fallen in front of the window when it fell, yeah? <gasps> that bothers me a little. Unless the glass was on top of her. Oh, I forgot. I think that's the case. Your voice acting is incredible. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> it it's, it's a tough game to voice because I have a rather high voice and all of these are deep voiced men. So I just gave, gave up on Phoenix. Phoenix gets my own voice. <laughs> no, everyone else, I, I try. I try. <laughs> Yeah, that is odd. I'm pressed further. Mr. White. <laughs> what? You're saying you saw the glass light stand. Phoenix should be default, so it works out. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> That's why I figured it's probably okay. I mean, if I was going to try to do an extra man voice the whole stream, like, I would tear my vocal cords to shreds. Do the deeper voices is hard for me. <laughs> It's a fun challenge, but it's hard. <laughs> now Maya's voice isn't deep. She's like the only one in this case other than April May. Yes. 
Then change your testimony to reflect that. Sorry, my bad. A witness will revise his testimony. You. Okay, okay, of course. A light stand was lying on the floor when I looked. I can't fucking see the floor. I can't fucking see the floor. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold it though, just in case. Hold it. And the glass stand is lying on the floor. That's the first time I've heard of this. But why didn't you tell us about the stand before? I'm sorry, I'm spinning again. You can probably tell by looking at my model when I'm spinning. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just really fun. Why me? Well, I was instructed not to wait. One moment. Give me a minute to gather my thoughts. <laughs> I am so, so confused. I, 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 ma'am. We got him. He couldn't have seen the light stand at the square window. Not on the ground. He only could have seen it as it was falling if it fell in front of the window. That's my, my theory anyway. <laughs> White's falling apart. And breakdown coming up, I think. Your Honor, please. I ask that you do not allow the witness to be badgered any further. Mr. Wright! Oh, by the way, for those of you who have never played this series before, once we get to the next case, case three, it's this case three is the first one where it doesn't actually show you in the cutscene who the killer is. So for some of you, it's gonna be a murder mystery ride. You're not gonna know who it is. You're not gonna know. <laughs> You're gonna watch us figure it out. <laughs> yeah, it's unlikely to have seen it falling and know what it is. That is true. <laughs> Please refrain from badgering the witness. Yes, your honor. No, Edgeworth is on the ropes. Very well, the witness may continue his account. I'm gonna go shove that evidence in no. Objection! I did Payne's voice because he's not here and I'm depressed without my husband. He has crack and lock of chicken like. Mr. White. I know who all the murderers are too. <laughs> but I lost his bit. It's more fun to find out. I'll probably drop a million red herrings, actually, to try to throw you guys off. <laughs> if you play an Ace Attorney of all females, I'd play an Ace Attorney with anyone. <laughs> Even if the characters are, like, worms, I'd play it. <laughs> oh. Bam! It was impossible for you to have seen the glass stands. What? Look at this. These are the floor plans for the scene of the murder, yes? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Correct, Your Honor. Now look. If you were to look through the window at the office, which I'm sure we've done a million times this trial, so it's actually kind of a surprise you didn't catch on to this sooner. Exactly, Nani! This is the area you would be able to see. Here. But you can see part of it, but you're not really gonna know what it is, I guess. It's just gonna look like broken glass. Well, note that the stand is not within the visible area. The stand part of it is, but part of the stand is. So that's kind of confusing. <laughs> yeah, if you put your thoughts in a zip folder, it'll be compressed and you won't have them open, so you'll forget who the killer is and it'll be more fun to enjoy anyway. Well, Mr. White, <laughs> I want some apple. After bang the table. Bang the wall. What do you have to say to that? Let's give him a minute to think of what to say to that while the apple. You're not a stand user. Only I am. 
I wonder, what, what do you guys think? What do you guys think would be the name of my stand if I had one? I've always wondered, but I've never settled on one. What would my stand be? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just wonder. One day I'll decide on what my stand would be. One day I'll decide. Power and money. <laughs> <laughs> I love the music. I actually own all the soundtracks to Ace Attorney. <laughs> I really, really like the series. It's, just, it's so cool. Virtual pleasure, that's fair, that's fair. Oh, maybe, is has Pamdo my stand? No, because you guys can see him. He can't be my stand, unless you're all stand users. Unless you're all stand users. Man, that'd be really cool. That'd be really, really efficient for running a company. Velocity. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's the wrong voice. Ridiculosity. Mr. White. Ahem. If you were the Gatewater Hotel as you claim, you could not have seen this down before it fell over. In fact, you wouldn't have been able to see it after it fell either. <laughs> Bouncing in the chair again now. There's no way you could have recognized the broken shards as a glass light stand. So, when did you see the stand, Mr. White? When you were murdering? When you were murdering? Oh, Pam number two is the stand. That's possible. I, oh, shit. <gasps> I was like, what's that creaking noise? That's the chair bouncing. I'll stop doing that. You guys, that's probably picking up on the mic and annoying you guys. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll stop it. I'll spin instead. Stop bouncing. <laughs> Bam. It must have been the moment that it fell. And the only place you could have seen that from is inside the Bay Law offices. In other words, you were at the scene of the crime when the murder took place. <laughs> didn't you? Mr. Your Honor. I, I, Miss Mia. Yeah, he about a squog. <laughs> Looks like we're about to get our verdict. Objection! Edward, what the fuck? That's far enough, Phoenix Wright. What? <sighs> Forgot about Edgeworth. <gasps> Mr. White. <clears throat> He's dying. I think the time has come. Shouldn't you confess your crime now? Edgeworth! <clears throat> what? Yeah, I said you should confess your crime. Ergo, confess that you placed the wire tap. I did. What? The wire tap? The fuck, Ezra? That's right. <laughs> order, order. Miss Redwood. Explain to the court what you mean by this. Yeah, I'm totally not. He's totally not leading the witness. Distinguished members of the court, Mr. White is slightly confused. Allow me to explain. I really don't like the way this is headed. He's playing dirty. <laughs> oh, I'm fine if I just playing dirty. As you know, Mr. White is the CEO of Blue Court. He ordered his secretary, Miss April May, to tap the law offices of Miss Finn. And what does that have to do? You're on. 
the question is, when was the wiretap placed in the office and by whom? Not me. <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you think I'd even care to do that? <laughs> Correct, Miles. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I messed up. Give me a break! Yes, in order to place the wiretap, I breached the Faye and Co. law offices. That is when I saw that accursed light stand. Blah! Fun, but I don't want to play it without Obaki Pam voiceover pack. <laughs> I promise it's really fun, even without the Obaki Pam voiceover pack. I promise it's really fun. You know what I recommend? Make your own voiceover pack when you play it. Just voice it yourself. It's really fun. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. <laughs> now I'm confused. Please explain to the court what all this means, Mr. Edgeworth. Gladly, Your Honor. Mr. Phoenix Wright has made his position quite clean. A smile clean is back, you're right. Ah, thank you, thank you, Noble, for the super chat. While you're working away like a ba, slave. Ba, ba, ba. <laughs> Donation for this pro bono case, Gallum Boss. Thanks, yeah, it's my pro bono case defending myself. <laughs> One He has determined that Mr. White knew the glass stand was in the office. He has shown that there was only one time Mr. White could have seen the stand. At the very moment of the murder. Thus, Mr. White would like you to believe that Mr. White was the murderer. He's claiming that I'm leading the judge. And he's leading the judge. Oh, I see. However, it is a fact that Mr. White had been to the office well before the murder took place. When he went to tell, tap the wire place. <laughs> when he went to place the wire tap. He could have seen the glass light stand then. Ergo, Mr. Phoenix Wright's theory is revealed for the baseless conjecture it is. Fuck. I gotta stop doing that. YouTube's getting mad. I got, how do I? Fuck <laughs> Fucking pass, right? <laughs> if I accidentally start, just change the word mid-word. No one knows the difference, right? Mr. White. The only one I can't figure out the voice for is Gumsu. Yeah, I know. I can't. I can't quite get it for him. I, I don't remember what I was doing before. <laughs> I think I gave him a goofy voice, but then I switched the judge to goofy voice because the old man voice was like too hard on my vocal cords. <laughs> so it's fine. I'll probably do Yanni's voice in old man though because Yanni doesn't speak very much, so it's fine. <laughs> you will testify to the court about this wire tapping. Of course. <laughs> Leave it to me. I'm Nah, i bastard. Can you lose in this game? Yes, you can lose in this game. I, I feel faint. Because my husband's so hot when he objects to me. Oh, damn. The sexual tension in this courtroom. Just wait till the next game when the whips get brought out. And no, I'm not kidding. For those of you who aren't familiar and think that was a joke, I am not kidding. <laughs> It was the beginning of September, the week before the murder. I had entered the Bay and Co. law offices 
Of course I had done so to place the wiretap. That is when I saw this glass light stand. That was a short testimony. Oh yeah, and the hot coffee. We're gonna be pouring black coffee on people's faces in one of the games. <laughs> it's really, it's really sexily done though. So you saw the stand before the nightly incident? And this is how you were able to identify what had fallen over by the sound? Mm, yes. Correct. That is right. Oh, I see very well, Mr. Wright. You may cross-examine. Gah! What am, I, what am I supposed to do now? Good luck, Phoenix. I am suffered. I want to be half as shiny as Mr. White. Half as shiny. When was the murder again? Beginning of September, okay, that timing lines up, so that's not gonna work. I guess he would lie about the timing of the wiretap, because I mean, he knew. all over like yeah my shiny stickers yeah Objection. Edgeworth shut up Miss April May knew the details of Miss Faye's phone conversation this proves that the wiretap was placed before the murder uh. ah right funny story Ow, dear. was it really you that went into the office this is for me ah thank Skittles for the sub. Wow. Getting subbed by a fellow company and a candy company. Nice. I love Skittles, especially sour Skittles. Or was it Miss May? Objection. Unidentified finger points several days old were found in the Fay and Co. Law offices. Those were obviously Mr. White's. And if I know Edgeworth, he's already run a check on those prints. So it was him. <laughs> Here, he knows for sure that White was already in there then. Now, Mr. White, tell us why you went into the Fay and Co. Law offices. <laughs> of course. Oh, I already did the reading. Oh, yeah. Why did you tap me as phone? I, I guess I could hit the bottom of my desk. It's kind of hollow, but... <laughs> KFC subs, I think I would like faint. <laughs> mm. Yeah, sour skittles are great when you want to exfoliate the mouth. They kind of rip the top layer of skin right off. <laughs> if you chew them, it's not so bad, but I'm more one to like suck on candy. So I'll just leave the skittle in there and then like, it just eats my skin. <laughs> it's worth it though, it's very delicious. This has no bearing on the current case, Your Honor. Blue Corp is a detective agency of sorts. Yeah, a blackmail agency. We have a responsibility to protect client confidentiality. I'm check one thing real quick. Why did you notice something as innocuous as a life stand? Yeah, you know, why would you remember that? I wouldn't remember that. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Okay, 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 we'll do that. Hold on. <laughs> okay, okay. Sexy CGI Colonel Sanders. Here's the thing. Why the absolute fuck is Colonel Sanders not a VTuber? Like, that is such a wasted opportunity. I mean, I'm a little biased because I really want to collab with Colonel Sanders. <laughs> I think I think I'd have a chance 
As a fellow company VTuber, maybe he'd be willing to collab with me. He'd be willing to collab with me. But seriously, why is Colonel Sanders not a VTuber? That is the perfect company mascot to be a VTuber. Colonel Sanders, I mean, there's KFC Gaming. He should be a VTuber and promote his gaming system. Like, it, it, just, it makes no sense that Colonel Sanders is not a VTuber. I'm almost offended. <laughs> I'm getting some... I'm getting some more drinking apple with this. They gotta be working on it. They gotta be working on it. I wanna collab with him. I also wanna collab with Crunchyroll Hime because if she can collaborate with Kizuna Eye, they have a model. They could just make her a VTuber. <laughs> Unrelated, but you know what's really hot? Um, your from Spy X Family. <laughs> mm, someone gifted me a copy of um, the second volume of Spy X Family, but it's in, in the French version. Uh, French version, because I like to read manga in French to get good practice. And um, your is on the cover, and she's just really hot in her assassin outfit. <laughs> I want to cosplay assassin your. I think that would be a good time. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, Wendy's, Wendy's, Wendy's. Wendy, sassy Wendy VTuber. Oh my God, sassy Wendy VTuber. You know who I don't want to be a VTuber though? Pringles, man. <laughs> Gotta be too cursed, too cursed. Also, I can. I think I can do without Ronald McDonald. That'd be a little too scary. I think Burger King would also be a little bit of a scary VTuber. <laughs> So I guess it made a lasting impression on me. It's not stylish, it's a boring old light stand. Such a beautacious thing. A botacious, maybe? Such a botacious thing deserves attention, does it not? Mr. Clean should be a VTuber, that would be great too. That is all. Damn it! There's nothing there for me to press him on. Oh well, maybe he's rattled enough that I can bluff something out of him. Shit. Mm -hmm. For the murder. Is this was September 5th? I don't think that's right, but we're gonna try it. <laughs> Objection! I was wrong. But I mean, technically, the timing doesn't line up. Paper, I forgot. <laughs> I might take back what I said about no backseating though, because now I feel like this immense sense of guilt that I didn't figure this out again. <laughs> so I wanna maybe go back to go back to that. I might go back to that. I guess this could have technically worked too though. I know it was crucial. 
That's as far as you go, Mr. Wright. The time has come for you to admit your defeat. You fought honorably. I don't get a game over here. It lets me move on a bit, right? No more. I think this is an Ow! Oh! I got a bug bite or something. Oh, no, it's a bruise. Okay, it's a bruise. I'm fine. It's just a bruise. I didn't realize I had a bruise somewhere and I scratched it. And I was like, wow, that hurts. <laughs> it's fine. It's just a bruise. I can't take this anymore. Mr. Wright, it's fine, it's fine. This is supposed to happen in the game. You're supposed to kind of give up here almost. Are you giving up? I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Someone's about to make an appearance. Yes, your honor. Phoenix. Good. I wonder, who do you guys think this is? Who do you guys think is about to come to my rescue? Who do you guys think is my knight in shining armor right now? Uh, a divine intervention. Phoenix, over here. I know that voice. Mia? Never give up, Phoenix. It's pain! <laughs> Where? Where am I? Is a waiting lobby? What happened? Oh, right. I lost the trial. Uh oh. I was hallucinating. Ah! <laughs> You're finally awake. Gah! I think again. Hey, Phoenix! <laughs> Gah! That's no way to greet an old friend. Phoenix, I want you to look at me. I'm looking respectfully. I'm looking respectfully. Y you're... M Maya? Didn't you know the Fey women have strong psychic powers? When you accepted your defeat in court, it appears that was enough of a shock to awaken Maya's true powers. Maya got them powers. Oh yeah, spirit lady and power. <laughs> So, Maya is channeling you, Mia? That's right. I am Maya, but I'm also Mia. This is when this game starts to get ridiculous. <laughs> now, I want you to listen to me, Phoenix. Maya never gave up. You can't either. That's what I came here to tell you. <laughs> Mia doesn't live. She's it's, it's her dead soul being channeled by Maya, the spirit channeler. Mia Mia is very dead. <laughs> Mia Fey channel. Ooh, I'd watch that. Mia the VTuber, damn. But we don't have much time, Phoenix. Now listen, you've already won. Ah, I think I lost. You have the receipt in the court record, right? Ah, that's why we were thinking of the receipt, Noe. Um, oh yeah, the one you wrote Maya on? Phoenix, White wrote that, not me. So, so, so what do I, 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 what do I do with it? Look at the front of the receipt. In soul stored in the chest, apparently. Yeah, it's even worse when you get Pearl Mia. <laughs> That's probably a spoiler, but whatever. <laughs> I figured once you see Pearl, you'll figure that it's coming. 
the front. I'm trying not to look at the front door. It's a regular receipt. Looks like it's from a famous department store. It's from Walmart. $1,000. Wow, a big spender. <laughs> this is obviously white, not me. Item. A glass light stand. Date of purchase, September 4th. And that was bought in September. Ah, yeah. I get it now. I got it now. The light stand was bought after he put the wiretap. Ah, yeah. September 4th! That's right, Phoenix. I bought that stand the day before I was killed. Yeah, he investigated the place, but he never thought to flip the paper. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> now, what did Mr. White say in his testimony? It was the beginning of September, the week before the murder. That's the day before. He said he saw the stand the week before the murder. There you go. I think the court is about to reconvene. Go do it, Phoenix. You know you're innocent. Now you just have to prove it. Right! Because I'm always right. I'm Phoenix right. Receipt update. Why can't I just check the receipt earlier and prove the same thing without having to have Mia come by? Oh, I guess it's nice to have her stop by. Back to anger. While we get the sucker in jail. <laughs> Gort will now reconvene for the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright. Is the defendant rather are you all right, Mr. Wright? I'm good, sorry. I'm fine now, I swear. No more faint, no more faint. Unless you bring cat poison for it, then we have a problem. Uh, then let's get where let's that. <laughs> let's start where we left off. <laughs> yaddy, yaddy. Oh, that's not the yaddy yaddy face. Your honor. There is nothing to get back to. The cross examination of Mr. White is finished. And that is a requested now. <gasps> ah! All that is requested now is for you to pass judgment on the defendant, Phoenix Wright. Bam! Your honor! Please give me one more chance. One more chance, one more chance. I don't know how the rest goes. I promise you, this is the last time I'll ask. Play, please. Mm. <laughs> but as Mr. Edgeworth has noted, the trial is more or less finished. No, it's not. Mr. Edgeworth, do you have an opinion on this matter? I have a big opinion. Yes. I say, let us give Mr. Wright his last chance. Oh, that sounded really hot coming from Edgeworth. <laughs> I'll take my last chance. Very well. You may begin your cross-examination. But I want an apple before he says it. <clears throat> I almost dropped my apple. It would have been really disappointing. I'll eat it and I'm eating it in my apple. Boom! It was the beginning of September, the week before the murder. 
I had injured the thing and call us him. <laughs> You're grasping. Grasping what? Bam! I think not! I'll see your pervert, Edgeworth. Look at the other side of that receipt. The, the other side? Your honor! Would you tell the court what is written on the other side of that receipt? Uh. Well, a glass light stand, on the day to purchase, and why that's the day before the murder. Yeah, he's grasping at his defense. <laughs> he's ducking on it. You see, Mr. White, when you allegedly entered Fanco Law Offices at the beginning of September. Stan could not have been there. Exact Phoenix sign can't stop me because I can't read. <laughs> I feel like Phoenix would use that excuse. <laughs> well, Mr. White. I think you Paul G. in there for the sub. You can't get out of this one, can you? He's been framed. No, it's impossible. Uh oh, he's losing it. Well, Your Honor. Yeah, it's in the break down, break down, break down, break down, break down. Woo! I understand there must be quite a bit of pressure on you. Yes, well. But I think you'll agree, you can't judge me guilty under these circumstances. Very well! Ah! That, that is all for the trial, huh? Objection! Ah! Uh, Not so fast. Ah, I see he's lagging now. Not so fast! Phoenix Knight. I'm sweating bullets. Eh. <laughs> it's, it's turned into soccer. <laughs> what? No way! He worm. No way can he worm his way out of this one. Oh, wait, I forgot. It says. <laughs> worm his way out of anything. There is a certain thread of logic into the defendant's plans. However, there is no concrete proof that Phoenix Wright is innocent. Ergo, I would like to request one more day before Phoenix Wright is granted his freedom. <gasps> what the? I need to make one more inquiry into this matter. I don't remember this. Ooh! Another inquiry? This isn't gonna be another one of those updated autopsy reports. <gasps> this guy just makes up evidence as he pleases. This is bad. No! No! <laughs> Ma'am, no! <laughs> Mr. White's guilt is obvious, and I thought we were gonna fucking finish this case today, so no, you can't have another day. <laughs> there is no need to prolong this trial any further. No need. Well, Mr. Edgeworth. Yeah, yeah. If anyone is going to call Mr. White to trial, it would be me, the prosecution. I need a day to ascertain whether these new claims have any basis in factual evidence. What the fuck? Ooh, I see. Objection denied. What? <gasps> I want to 
cry. The completion of the trial of Mr. Fe oh. The completion of the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright will be postponed till tomorrow. I thought for sure this case only had two trials. No, there's no telling what'll happen if I can't end it now. Ezra, there's sure to come up with or just make up something. And after Mia showed up to help me and all. Mm. <laughs> Mr. Your Honor, may I go home? No. Of course, thank you for your time. I hate this. Gah! Gah. The witness will stay! Get him, wifey. Get him, wifey. Mia. Phoenix. Read this note out loud. Okay. okay. Mia, what's this? Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Your Honor, if I may, if I may. You are quite persistent today, Mr. Wright. Yeah, and Edra stands called a gumshoe. <laughs> you bet I am, my life is riding on this one. <laughs> I have something I would like to read to the court. A stop mad mode. Take that! Oh my god, I forgot. Take that. <laughs> the memo Mia had given me was a list of names. Many of them sounded strangely familiar. People in finance, famous celebrities, like me. That's when it happened. Stop! Desist! Halt! Please stop! Make him stop! Yeah, yeah, da. Oh. How did you get that list? Wifey gave it to me. You're busted, bro. You're busted, bro. The buster bro is here to destroy you and all of everything but Ikebukuro. Mr. White. Admit your guilt right here, right now. Or else this list will be released to the press. <laughs> it's the blackmail. She's blackmailing him with his own blackmail. I I confess. I confess. Ah, thank you, Alex, for the super. Just popping in to add the Maya's burger budget. Nice. I'm gonna have to take her out for burgers and a sex I need. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> the case closed, Your Honor. Ezra's having a breakdown. <laughs> My cheeky smug face. Well, I see no reason to continue this trial. Because he admitted. I missed his lines, though, because I didn't realize it was auto-going. That kind of sucks. <laughs> That's okay. I got his breakdown. Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor? You've done it again! That was quite a spirited defense. Yeah, Your Honor. I guess you could say that. If only you knew how spirit, <laughs> spirit and it was. Get it? It was spirited. Has spirit. <laughs> well, this court finds the defense. Ready? Ready for it? Yes, thanks. You're obligated to laugh. Fog is the only one doing their job. You are all obligated to laugh at me. <laughs> this court finds the defense. You ready? Rather the defendant, Mr. Phoenix, right? Not guilty! I'm not innocent. I'm not guilty. I guess it's the same. I'm not that innocent. I'm only not guilty. That is all. This court is adjourned. Yay! <laughs> we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it! With the power of waifus. We destroyed red, white. <laughs> Woo! I'm gonna, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, all the employees who were late, I'm also tossing you over the edge of the balcony right now. You're also extra confetti. 
Well, I never thought I'd be saying this again. But congratulations. You're lucky I was born a fae. <laughs> yeah. I'm lucky I had both you and Maya on my side. I'm glad you made it. <laughs> Thank you, Phoenix. You risked a lot to help me. And Maya. I won't forget it as long as I live. You're dead. <gasps> You're not obligated to remember. You're already dead. <laughs> I won the battle of CEOs. As long as you live. So, like, it'll just forget. You're already forgotten, basically. <laughs> My time here is running out. Ah. Maya's powers are still weak. I can't stay here not long. <laughs> no, there's still so much to say. Don't worry. I'm sure we'll meet again. Chief! <laughs> I'm not the chief anymore. I'm chief now, baby. <gasps> My office. Phoenix? Can you come to the office tonight? Say, nine. Oh, yes I can. Yes I can. Yes I can come to the office at nine after hours. Yes I can do that. Yes I can do that. This sounds like more of this, um, um, overtime. <laughs> it's set with Mia. <gasps> Not has Pamdo this time. It's overtime with Mia. Ah, yeah. The office? <laughs> I'll see you later. Okay. Mia! <gasps> Mia! Mia and has Pando? Oh no, that's too dangerous. And my heart can't handle that. <laughs> also, he's in the warehouse, not the office, unfortunately. Oh man! Oh man! Office! Office attire has Pando. I would die. I couldn't handle that. I'd be deceased. <laughs> Corporate has Pando. Megane is required. Megane is required. Being here, it's hard not to think about that night. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think he meant the murder. <laughs> you game. Worried you might not. I think it's Maya. Oh, of course I came. Well then, <laughs> I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> How about a burger? Uh, me, Mia. Since when did you like burgers? <laughs> yeah, dress is pain. This Pando cosplaying pain. I oh, yeah. <laughs> they both have gray hair. <laughs> With some really good um, marinated egg, marinated boiled egg, and like um, barbecue pork that melts in your mouth, green onion, a broth that maybe has like a bit of sesame paste and a bit of spicy, but it's very creamy. Oh yeah, tonkotsu burger. Mm, I love some tonkotsu burger. Tonkotsu burgers are my favorite. Ebi tempura burger. Oh man, those are also really good. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Mm, mm, mm. Huh. They might be able to use that. I'm gonna get some apple. I had a burger for lunch, actually. It took a long time to cook, though, because the broth wasn't boiling properly. It wasn't an instant burger. It was homemade burger. Homemade from scratch burger. So it took quite a while. <laughs> instant 
icebreaker is not really my thing. Hot. I actually burnt my tongue on it because the broth was really hot. <laughs> I, I feel like it actually didn't have any meat in it, right? Um, instead of meat, I used I used like egg drop soup strategy burger, and I um I just scrambled an egg in a little bit and boiled it a tiny bit more. I didn't have meat in this one. <laughs> it was just egg. Yeah, jelly donuts go really really well with burgers. I love jelly donuts with my burgers. Mm -mm. Nice and salty. <laughs> oh, Phoenix! Go to the store and buy me lunch, would you? Oh, Maya, why are you here? <laughs> because of this! See? Mia wrote me a letter. Take care of Phoenix for me. Take care of... What? This child is gonna look after me? Okay, he's cute. She means the office. In this office. Someone has to help with the new Wright and Cola offices, right? A my cute assistant. And you better but me! Maya Faye reporting for duty! <laughs> Wait, no, I'm just gonna thought. Let's make this casual. Yo, Nick! Maya here, ready to get down to business! You, don't mind me calling you Nick, do you? It's a great name. Thanks, Kyle Bennett, for the sub. I am. She wants lunch at nine? Yeah, who doesn't want lunch at nine? <laughs> it's a great name. Mia said that's what your friend Larry calls you. Yeah, Maya always wants lunch. <laughs> Maya's basically just me. We're twins. Nick? Yeah, no and cola until Apollo shows up, though, basically. You know what this means? We're partners! Oh, yeah, cutest partner for the cutest, cutest lawyer. You know, when I think about it, it is Maya's fault I'm here right now. But if it wasn't for her, I'd probably be in jail. <laughs> I'd be, like, dead on death row. Mm -mm. Right in cold law offices. It's good, got a good ring to it. Maya. I love this cute CG. I, I am screenshot. <laughs> Good luck, Phoenix. Look how cute we are. Look how cute we are. It's adorable. It's adorable. Yeah, Maya must be protected like a million times. She's always getting framed for murder. <laughs> and I'll always be here watching. Okay, Nick, let's do it. What? Do what? Burgers, dummy! Burgers! <laughs> There's a great burger joint just down the street. Come on! Time's a wasting. Okay. Wait up. Yeah, the end. We beat the whole series now. It's over. Not just this case. <laughs> I, here we go! My favorite case, my favorite case! Woo, baby! That's the helmet that I made. I made the helmet for the Steel Samurai. <laughs> I'm not gonna do the next case, but I wanna watch the cutscene. I wanna introduce you to it. We'll watch it again next time. <laughs> I just wanna real quick, real quick watch the cutscene. If there's text before, we're gonna skip to it. It's Tokusatsu Ace Attorney. <laughs> Here we go! We'll voice it next time. This is a preview. This is my ringtone. Oh my god, controller vibrate on that. That was great. Da, 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 da. We got 
I get to the murder, I'm gonna skip real fast through everything. <laughs> oh wait, this one doesn't have a murder cutscene. I forgot about that. That's why you don't know who the killer is in this one. Never mind. Okay, we done. We done here. We done here. You'll learn more about this guy later. <laughs> That's it then. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that case. <laughs> that it's it's one of my favorite games. And I think that's probably the most iconic case in the series. Maybe behind DL6, but it's definitely one of the most iconic cases in the series. Um, it's a really, really fun series. I like it a lot. Also, for those of you still here, don't go anywhere because I got a giveaway. I got a giveaway. So. Who is excited about the great Ace Attorney? Are you excited? Are you excited for the great Ace Attorney? Let me know if you're excited in chat for the new great Ace Attorney. Because I might be able to give away a copy. I might be able to give away a physical copy. I'm going to pull up an image of it for those of you. Actually, no, I'm just going to get it online. Give me one sec. Give me one sec. Give me one sec. Ba -ba 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 -ba. It's gonna take me a minute to pull it up. Okay, okay, okay. I'm seeing what windows I have up. Make sure I can get the right one. The right one. The right one. Okay, okay, I think I can get it now. Give me a sec, give me a sec. This should work, in theory. Ba -ba. Here we go. I'm too lazy to resize it, so you just get a full one. It's gonna kinda block me for a minute, I'm sorry. <laughs> if you wanna win a copy of this, yeah, James, I didn't inform you because I'm just like impulse giving it away. If you want to win a copy of the Great Ace Attorney Chronicles, um, it, there is a physical release that works in English for Switch, but there's also a PS4 copy. I like it's old pain. <laughs> so you can kind of choose, I guess. Um, yeah, I wanted to give away a copy of this because I'm so in love with the series. And I wanted to get more appreciation. Oh my god, he's blushing. Who is this? Say Fuku. <laughs> that's not the way you would have expected to say Fuku in this series, but here you go. Ah, yeah, Vampire Edward. Oh man, there's handcuffs. This game gets real spicy. I didn't expect that. The gameplay looks quite a bit different too. It's almost similar to Phoenix vs. Layton. How there's a bunch of people. Anyway, that, me showing it off, Gave a decent amount of time for people to speak up if you wanted a copy, yeah? Oh god, it showed my bot. <laughs> oh well. Anyway, um, that gave away a decent amount of time for you guys to see it. So I'm gonna roll a giveaway. Give me, give me a sec. Give me a sec. Are you ready? <laughs> see who gets it? See who gets it? See who gets it? One sec. Looks like Tiger Cats, I love them won the giveaway. I yeah! <laughs> That's really lucky, because you also got murder by numbers. <laughs> I am using a random thing, but okay. Okay. If you don't want it, I can give it to someone else. But if you want to try being a lawyer, even though you think you're too dumb for it, you can. <laughs> Ay -ya. One second, one second, one second. Ba -ba -ba. One second, one second. Okay, okay. And though it's mine now, you know you want it, okay. <laughs> okay. I guess you got a copy now. <laughs> you can share it with 
Don Don Duck because you said you guys are roommates, right? And they didn't win anything, so you can you can share it. You can you can maybe gift it to them when you're done. Maybe like a share it a little bit. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, you're on the Discord, I think. Um, so just just post there that you won again, because you don't have Twitter, I believe, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just post in the Pam chat. And be like, I won the Ace Attorney. <laughs> Yeah, you get a nice, a nice physical copy of that. Anyway, that is rather exciting in my opinion. It's a very good game. I'm getting a physical copy too. I'm really, really excited. <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's all for today's stream. I'm really glad that I got to share my favorite game so much with you guys. I hope I can continue it eventually, but I'm probably gonna take a bit of a break because this one is a big commitment. <laughs> So probably after we finish the case, we'll take a break for quite a while. And then maybe come back to the case and for a while do like one stream a week until we beat the case or something and then take a break again for a while. Because where it's episodic, it's quite easy to split and break up. So I think that would be the best way to continue it, yeah? But for the rest of the week, on Wednesday, I've decided that I need my own cat boy harem. And I've also been sucked in because everyone on the internet is horny for bunny boys. And honestly, the design is really good. I'm, I'm not really gonna say I'm immune here. I'm not even gonna pretend. So I thought it might be fun to start Final Fantasy XIV. I can't decide yet. Um, we're gonna be starting it on stream, so I'm gonna play around with it and experiment a bit. Um, yeah, the cases get really long. They really do in this series. These were the shorter ones. But um, yeah, 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 we're gonna start we're gonna start Final Fantasy XIV on Monday. I'm mostly gonna be messing around with it for now, and if I like it, we can continue. And um, maybe even do some collabs with it or something, because I know a bunch of VTubers play it, yeah? Um, but it's it's gonna be a good time, I think. Um, as a little bonus for members, a couple hours beforehand, I'm actually doing a members-only stream where I do the character customization. So if you're a member and you wanna help me decide what to do for the character, I, I can't quite decide. I'm not sure if I'm gonna have you guys, like if I'm gonna do live polls on stream. Actually, yes I am. I'm gonna do live polls on stream for members because I wanna test that out because there's a stream I wanna do next week that requires polls. Like the whole stream is basically interacting with polls. I can't explain because I want it to be a surprise. But I want to make, a cat boy harm, someone's playing the new Nekopara on the side. I'm not playing it on the side, not a bot 55. I fucking streamed it. <laughs> it's it's a it's it's a it's an interesting stream. Um, I'm not gonna talk about it. Watch at your own discretion. <laughs> but yeah, I think it would be fun to start a cat boy and bunny boy harem, basically. So I'll collab with lots of people, maybe, but only if they play as cat boys or bunny boys. But I can't decide if I want to be a cat boy, so I can be like king of the cat boys. Like, I don't know if I want to be Haspando Catboy, or if I want to be Haspando Bunny Boy, <laughs> or if I want to be, like, Cat Girl Pam, so I can be the only female that all these male cats have the option. <laughs> or do I want to be, like, um, a Lalafell? Do I want to be the little gremlin queen of the cat boys? I don't know. I really like the Lalafells, too, so it's, it's kind of it's kinda hard to decide. It's, it's kind of hard to decide. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's gonna it's gonna take some time to figure out. So I think the members only stream would be a fun way to do it. Cause then you guys can help me decide when I'm indecisive. Cause if I do it alone, I'm just gonna sit there for like four hours not making any decisions. <laughs> and then on Saturday, we're gonna be back with some news. This is gonna be our second news segment. Mm -mm -mm. And after that, I'm gonna be checking out the Neo The World Ends With You demo because I'm really interested in the graphics. As someone who's been in Japan, like the recreations of some of the streets are just incredible. The graphics blew me away. And I really wanna check it out because it looks amazing. I'm gonna be honest, I haven't actually played the first game. I, it's always interested me, but I never really got around to it. I never found a physical copy and I was too stubborn to get digital. So I just didn't. <laughs> But I want to check out the new one so bad. I want to check out the new one so bad. But yeah. Um, that's it for now. 
I'm gonna go rest up a little bit and then I got some stuff to work on for you guys in the future. Ooh. And, um, yeah, I have another song for the ending, so stick around. Stick around if you wanna hear my other Turnabout musical cover. Bye. Don't think you're getting away from me that easily. Look, Maya, what are you doing here? You're gonna keep Sis's office, aren't you? Yeah, of course. So, would it be okay if I stayed here for a while? You mean in the office? Well, you know, I, I'd work here. So you're applying for a job. Well, okay, do you have any prior experience with nope. the law form? Uh, did you study your sister's Not techniques? Not a bit. Do you have any knowledge at all about law? whatsoever. Maya, I'm starting to wonder what exactly you could do for me. Lots of things. I'll water Charlie each time you forget. I'd clean the litter if you had a pet. I'll keep the couch warm whenever you're gone. And sometimes I may mow the lawn. What lawn? I promise your remotes won't gather dust. And that your TV trays never will rust. I don't need gratitude or a high pay. Well, okay. Just feed me four meals every day. <laughs> Courtroom, I'll help you defend. Every time they have smart day, I'll provide a pleasant mood. All that we have, we can share. You'll lend your money, your home, and your food. And it's true that for you, will be there. That sounds like a nice arrangement, ain't it? Well, oh no, that's not all I can provide. Just oh, wait. Oh, Maya. Cause nobody but fights father like that's not thing. my forte And as the caretaker of us frankly I freak I had a golden and she died in a week I babysat poorly way back in the day They paid me to keep me away I can't see myself undertaking this task So please don't think I'm a jerk To help you around is the one thing I ask And I've got a hunch this is going to Wait a minute, are you asking to live here? In the office? <laughs> of course not, I'm not sleeping here. That'd just be weird. I'm only gonna be working and maybe spending all my free time here, you know, watching your TV, eating your food, that sort of thing. Uh, that's not exactly sweetening the deal. Well, there is one other reason. This note, I found it in my stuff a couple weeks ago. Mia must have slipped it in last time I visited. Here, if anything should happen, take care of Phoenix for me. She must have known how risky your pursuit of red light was. She trusts us to watch out for each other. Yes. <laughs> the truth is. Well. <sighs> Since Mia passed on, I felt all alone and torn up inside. All hope was lost, and I had no shoulder to cry on. Let's go celebrate with some burgers. Your treat? 